Okay. All right. Give me a second, everybody. Okay. Sorry, bear with me. Gotta get the link. Gotta tweet the link. You know how it is. Oh, just a second. Oh no! Ah, beans! Nobody panic, everything's fine. Hello? He Hello? Hold on. Oh, missed connections. We're trying to get blue on the call, guys. <laughs> um, uh, busy day. Oh, oh, speak, friend. Hello. Hello. Are we in? Sorry, I, I called, and then my um, uh, audio wasn't routing through my headphones, so I needed to go click a bunch of stuff. Oh, okay. Them. Yeah, sorry. I, I thought I missed the call. It was so routing that was on me. everywhere else. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay, let me just... Uh, tweet the link um ba -ba -ba. okay all right well chat you know what to do i'm seeing taters in chat that's a good sign uh if anything is wrong um lemons i guess <laughs> um all righty uh blue can you add the uh donation link working on it thank right you now. perfect then i will start the game hacha Oh, yeah, let me in. Right, let me lower the volume there just a skosh. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, like, I can hear that on my uh, thing right now. Yeah, sorry. It shouldn't route through too hard, but, uh, yeah. Okay, great. Great, I'm seeing an, uh, a surplus of taters. Precious. Um, so, uh... <laughs> Blue, I'm not sure if I got you up to speed on what exactly uh, we did last time. Um, we uh, have acquired two-thirds of the Guardian armor, because why not? Oh, I won't let me up. Uh, and then we dyed it red, because we had to. Um, and uh, we also cleared out the Forgotten Temple of all its Guardians. Oh, wow. Yeah, because we really wanted to get the Guardian Cuirass, and I miscounted how many gears I needed. It was a whole thing. Um... All right, where are we going? Up to Zora's Domain. Yeah, that makes sense. You know what? Let's just start from Kakariko Village. Make things easier on ourselves. Um, because you lovely, lovely people in chat uh, managed to donate $10,000 to Direct Relief uh, last week and over the course of the, the week that the VOD was up, uh, I promised to go and do Varuda next. So that's where we're going. <laughs> Um, <laughs> I have been stalwartly avoiding this quest line, so uh, we have not done any. Like we've talked to all the Zora except Sidon, uh, because you know, <laughs> why not, right? Um, all right, let's see. Uh, all right, this castle. Is, uh, just get up and about. We've done a lot this time because we we also got the Master Sword last time, uh, which was fun. So now we have that, uh, which will be very useful, I think. Um, Made our way through the last woods, did all the Korok trials. Um, oh yeah, there it is. You can see that ominous cloud in the horizon. Let me go back to my regular outfit. This is really kind of a, this is a special occasions armor set. Um, where's my, where's my good pants? There we go. We're good. All right, back in business. Um, hmm. Anyway, yeah, so we, we just went through, cleared out the Forgotten Temple. So if we, uh, if we finish this before the next Blood Moon, we could uh, go back and do some archaeology. You know, look through all the cool stuff there. Um, let's see. Or if we don't get back there before the next Blood Moon, we can go back anyway, <laughs> clear it out again, get more Guardian parts. Um, <laughs> We just set up a nice, wholesome little farm in the ruins of the Forgotten Temple. <laughs> it's honestly not that difficult once you get the hang of it. Oh boy. Yeah, that's probably fine. Uh, it's gonna be extra fun doing uh, navigation in an area that appears to be constantly raining. I'm sure that's nothing to worry about. Okay. Let's see if we can get directions to Sidon. I'm sure if we walk around for like 15 minutes, we're gonna run into some Zora who's like, hey, 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 you should go talk to our boss. My hunky boss needs your help. <laughs> <laughs> He'd just be so happy 
Oh, no, give me that. Oh, whatever. It's fine. All right, Link, it's cool. Whatever. Down to the wetlands we go. I feel like the Va Meadow quest line is so brisk in comparison to Va Ruta. Um, cause there's, oh, like, yeah. there's the layers. One. Yeah. Cause it's, it's just like, prove yourself five targets in three minutes. Like, the only way that doesn't work is if, like, you, you don't know how the bow controls work. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. I've seen a few people be like, why does she use motion controls on the bow? Cause that's the best way to do it! <laughs> It's legitimately easier to be able to aim where you're looking. All right, you're welcome, chat. I got the Korok. We're moving on. Oh, there is an opportunity for um, uh, some some chat perverse incentive. Uh, uh -oh. Well, you know the Varuda quest line. It's got uh, it's got a Lionel in it. That we can either sneaky sneak around, or, um... Oops. Well, I'm not dealing with that. Sorry, Chad. But, uh, yeah, there's a Lionel. We can either sneak around it and collect, um, the, uh, shock arrows that we need, or we can, um, kill it. <laughs> so I think... Ah, there she is. Hello. Hello. Tell me about your boss, please. No, come back. Hey, wait. Hey, wait. Excuse me. Hey. <laughs> I, I will. Just remind me where he is. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh-huh. Upstream of Zora River at Inogo Bridge. Okay. All right. Thank you, Tona. All right. Bye. Chat seems to be doing okay. Yeah, I'm not sure which goal to set to, to kill the line. I mean, we need to get to Zora's domain first, and that's actually going to be a bit of a bit of a hike. Maybe if we hit like 2k before I go fight the Lionel, or before I go deal with the Lionel, I try and kill it instead of just you know running around <laughs> hiding. Yeah, 2k to kill a Lionel. Yeah, sounds fair. Admittedly, it is <laughs> only a red Lionel. <laughs> Whoops. No. Uh, okay. Nice. Ah, don't need that, I guess. Actually, is that better than the shields I have? Oh. Okay. Weird. All oh, right. Maybe I'm just used to having a small inventory. Small inventory, who dis? Yep. Excuse me. <laughs> sir? Sir. Oh, I might be a little high level for this area. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a good problem to have, I'd say. <laughs> Whoopsies. Oh no. The rain has found me. Falling from the sky like a memory. <laughs> Passing? No, we're fine. Oh! Hey, I found him! <laughs> Look at it! There he is! Side on. <laughs> Young one! Up top! Above you! He's gonna jump down. He's gonna jump down. He's gonna, he's gonna do it. He's gonna. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Very slow pan. Hey there, good looking. What's Pardon up? The entrance, but you are Pardon the entrance. I'm sorry, I'm just too I cool and sexy. You'd have a moment to talk. Hoping you have a Perhaps you'd have a moment to talk. Ah. Aha! Hylian! Yes, I knew it! Oh, pardon me. <laughs> Sorry, the Zora Prince! Ah, oh, he did the Character thing. Character design is the height of fashion because it's just a little, like a little kerchief ascot thingy on his neck. Uh, and no pants! West. No pants. <laughs> <laughs> Your name is Link? What a fantastic name! Ah, oh, you sweet tongue and flatterer. I cannot shake the feeling that I've heard it somewhere before. In case it is a strong name. Uh, to be honest, I've been watching you. You really dicked around a lot before coming to say hi. <laughs> oh. 
You went to do the dumbass bird first? Come on! You must be a strong warrior among the Hylians, correct? <laughs> well, not to brag, but uh, this is the sword yeah. of evil's bane on my back. Aha! Just as I suspected. <laughs> yes, exquisite. I've been searching for someone like you for a long while. A man like you, Link, who carries himself with power. Uh, no, courage. Power is the other guy. Yeah. <laughs> So his domain is in grave danger. We don't, we don't talk about him. He's yeah, on. He's, he's, he's a bit Grata taboo. In the grave yeah. danger because of the massive rainfall coming from Divine Beast Valruta. Please, promise you will help us. We need your strength, warrior. Yeah, I guess. Won't you please come to the source domain with me? Sure thing. I'll think on it. Oh, yeah, we'll, we'll do it. <laughs> wow, really? <laughs> Thank you, Ling. You are indeed the man I thought you were. Now, Zora's domain will be saved for certain. No time to waste. Hurry up and head over. Uh, thanks. Yeah, the cliffs are too wet to climb. You need to go straight along this path. As a Hylian, I know you are unable to swim up the river. As such, the path to the domain may be a bit treacherous. You will play have a tough fight in store. There are monsters up ahead that attack with electricity. Oh, my favorite! <laughs> Don't give up! I believe in you! <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Oh, yes! I have something I would like to give you. A small trinket to show that I have faith in you. Ah, sick! An electro elixir! Mm. Not sure why, but its effects do not seem to work for Zora. Perhaps because it was made specifically for Hylians. We are very different animals, so that makes sense. <laughs> Cool. Whee! <laughs> and he's gone! Or was he ever truly here? Ah, uh, go on, you majestic beast. Okay! Adventure! Now, the fact that we have Rivali's Gale does mean we could probably bypass at least some of this, but, eh, you know, what's the harm? Nah. Yeah, I think this is the area we're supposed to do first. Ow. Yeah, they really aren't planning on you to have the skip all of Whoops. the climbing uh, button. I've never parried this before. I wonder if you can. Oh, I see. It just can't hit me. Wait, hold on. Do I have regular arrows? I do! I don't need to waste these good ones. Sir! Alright, anyway. Moving on. Ah, good stuff. I'm glad they didn't, like, over-level this area. You know, would be a little bit annoying. <laughs> God forbid I experience the slightest inconvenience on my journey. <laughs> Plenty inconvenienced by the uh, pre-existing death that was in the way. Yeah, don't worry. There's more inconveniences to come. I do have trouble with... Uh, Water Blight Ganon. Uh, well, yeah. Valruta is not the worst. Puzzle-wise, it's pretty cool. Um, yeah. But, boy, howdy. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Uh, yeah. <sighs> I don't know. Water Blight's annoying. I think every Blight has something that you can't really do anything about except for just, you know, evade. Because uh, with Wind Blight, it's the tornadoes. You just kind of have to dodge those. Um... Water Blight isn't too unmanageable, it's just a little bit annoying. Oh! Yeah! Yeah! Great. Okay, okay jeez. Ow! <laughs> okay, well, I deserve that a little bit. Um, anyway. Wasn't it the, the design of Guardians in Breath of the Wild was like kind of inspired by Octoroks in the first game, where they're so huge compared to- No, come on. Okay, um, fine. Yes? Yes. I think that's a were... Zeltic thing again. Um, yeah, it's also, uh... Ow. Oh. Come on. Show yourself. Ah. Oh no, my, my forest dwellers go. No. Oh, I gotta, I'd have to go back to yeah. shooting normal okay. scrub arrows one it's at a time. It's also, um, the, like, shape and size is based off of the Octorox, mm. as I recall from the, that same Zelda video. <laughs> yes. But also the visual aesthetic of the Guardians and the whole, like, Sheikah oh. tech thing is based off of Jomon area, uh, Jomon era pottery. Oh yeah, the, the pots Japan, and stuff. Japan, which is 14,000 to 300 BC, according to this random tweet on Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, the best source. Oh, there it goes. It's 
Yeah, okay, no, that is correct. Uh, yeah! <laughs> websites where you should never take anything that is said. Twitter and Tumblr. Yeah. And most of Reddit. Most of Reddit. Parts of Wikipedia. Yeah. Really, I mean, just it, check your sources on everything. Yeah. And if you look up Jomon period, just like on Google Images, the first image result is this little pottery figure whose face looks almost exactly like Robbie's robot. Aww. It is the same. <sighs> Dude, what was your plan there? Do you even have a weapon? Well, thanks for the arrows, I guess. All right. Well, we could go down, but we're not yep, going to do that. <laughs> we're going to yeah, we're going to take a shortcut. It's the same face. Same same big old eyes. Okay. <laughs> With them big ol' eyes. Oh, the chonkier boy. Oh no, my master sword. I guess I'll just have to content myself with all these other weapons. Right, let's get rid of this. I guess the one thing is that because this area is a little bit underleveled, or uh, I'm a little bit overleveled for it, all the weapons I'm getting are a little bit crap. <laughs> um, uh, well. Well, the Master Sword doesn't recharge on its own, so I guess we'll just use it up, give it a 10 minute recharge. Um, is that a sledgehammer? Oh, I killed a bunch of Taluses last time. I'm kind of hoping we get another board game so I can go back and do it again, because I've never, like, like grinded Taluses for, um, like, gems before, but it's so efficient, and they're not even that hard. So, honestly, kind of a dream. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I upped my, my mic a little bit. Sir! Um, oh yeah, you sound good. Yeah, because it had me... Uh, I, I, I pulled up... Because, like, Discord has its thing, but then you have to pull up your own system preferences. And on my system preferences, that was a little low. So. Whoa! Carrying with the Lionel Shield hurts him? Wait! Yes, because wow. the Lionel Shield has blades on it. Fun. You know, I think it said that in the item description, and I just have never tried it before. All right. Nice shortcut. Ah, sorry, bud. Maybe next blood moon. Jeez. All right, do I have anything crappy? Uh, all of these are kind of crappy. Oh well. Ow! What? Huh? Like, please stop ragdolling. Come on, man. <laughs> okay. Sheesh. I didn't know that you could get injured by deer. <laughs> Alright, how are we looking? Alright, yeah, it's all coming together. <laughs> oh, you just see it? No, I just, you said it's all coming together, so oh, I... yeah. Call response. Of course, yeah. Alright, we're just gonna not deal with the electric keys if we can help it. Oh, hold on. They're, uh, they're not going to give you a choice in this battle, it looks like. No, just kidding. Yeah. Critical path who? <laughs> Intended game design what? <laughs> nah. Ah, there we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. Ooh, I wonder how many of these guys we can get. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Oh, hold on. Uh, next weapon, please. Uh, let's get rid of the crappy ones. Perfect. Awesome. Okay, moving on. Aw, oh, sick. Yeah, steak. Oh, man. What a pleasant stroll this is. Oh, excuse me. Hold on. Man, I'm really breaking even on the arrows for, for like the first time ever. Yeah, this this area is thick with arrows. Oh boy. You know, really this is just uh this is just making me confident so that when I have to deal with the Lionel, uh <laughs> my hubris comes crashing down around my ears. Yeah, here? so what's this about a uh, um a, a poll on Tumblr uh of Oh print? 
yeah, OSP that's right. people against each other, and you lost to your hubris. Yeah, yeah. And I only barely eked out a win against the ninjas. Yeah, they're doing some kind of um uh OSP bracket with like us and you know uh some of the gods and all that jazz. Oh, excuse me. Did he just pick up a rock to throw at me, sir? Come on, clever girl. Come on, get. <laughs> <laughs> they're learning. Oh get no. Up. Not that much. Oh, is someone having trouble climbing? That's so weird. Anyway, okay. <clears throat> Give me a oh, Ooh, Ruby. Heck yeah. But yes, they, they pitted me against my own hubris, which honestly, like, that's an unfair matchup. Come on, guys. <laughs> so I've been eliminated, which is very funny. I'm glad they're having a good time. Ah, oh, for crying out loud. What do you guys have against me walking up this mountain? I like how Zora's Domain has these, like, coral things just on land. It yeah. Once again makes me question the complex biodiversity of Hyrule in such a small area, but, you know, what do I know? Yeah. I suppose in a world that was explicitly created by goddesses, like, who knows? Anything could be. They could get screwy with, with the terrain builder. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Alright. Nothing there, nothing there. Where'd the nicer spear go? Oh, did it go over the cliff with it? Oh, no, there it is. Okay, cool. Alright, let's, uh... Yeah, let's just swap. At least the Zora spear looks nicer. Okay, moving on. Ooh. Hello. This is fun. Hey! Sir! I'm admiring the Zora's cultural heritage. Oh, for crying out loud! How many of you people are there? Oh, boy. Whoop! <laughs> Answer. More. More. Ah! Always more. No, my Lionel shield! <laughs> Okay, this is actually very funny because it's only hurting this other guy, but also it, it really hurts. So let's eat some food. Uh, <laughs> all right, let's see. Oh, let's just get through this one. We don't really need any effects right now. Perfect. All right, he's dead. Good work, team. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, get out of here. All right. Leave any arrows behind? Yeah. All right, let's not deal with that again if we can help it. Whoops. Hey, hey, turn this way. Yeah! Okay. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, this is working out really well. Oh, what's that? Oh. <laughs> I think that's our destination. <laughs> oh, yep. <laughs> I remember the first time I was playing Breath of the Wild and I inadvertently stumbled onto Varuda. I mm. came from the opposite side of Zoro's domain, so I didn't actually do the Sidon quest yet. Ah. Um, and I'm like, what the hell is that? So I tried to, like, paraglide into this little like caldera looking thing because i was i was up on the the high ridge and i, I could paraglide down but i got close to Varuda and it's it's like force fields knocked me off and into the water and then of course it's too far to swim to shore so i oh. drowned so I, I was wondering tried, you know throwing myself at this thing a few times to no avail and eventually i'm like all right fine i'll, I'll <laughs> come back to that later and then oh. only like several hours down the line that I actually go back to the front of the river and, and do the whole Zora's Domain quest. I'm like, oh. That's really funny. <laughs> yeah. I was wondering. I didn't know what Varuda's defenses were. Um, all right, thanks, Sidon. I like that the, the reason why Sidon isn't... Oh, for God's sake. Beware, warrior. A monster approaches from behind you. Oh, no, what? What? 
But yeah, the fact that he's the reason why he's not coming with us. Come on. Excuse me. Let me. Switch to a slightly heavier weapon. Um, the reason why he's not coming with us is because all these guys use electric weapons, and it's canonical that Zora uh, are extremely weak to them. Yeah. Great. Well, that was fun. Uh, yeah, I'm good. Thanks. Okay, moving on. Um, because a lot of times in video games, like. When a character's like, I'm sorry, champion, only you can do this plot thing. It's like, really? You can't even help? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> and it makes them seem like kind of a jerk uh, or like they're manipulating you. Uh, and I like that the way this game kind of makes it happen is like, no, these guys would do want to help you out uh, and would if they could. But there's legitimately a reason they can't. Oh, hey. Hey, Nadra. What's poppin', girl? <laughs> All right, well. A little far away. We do need to start collecting more dragon bits so we can up the champion's tunic later. Um, oh, so majestic. So beautiful. Did I get a picture? I genuinely don't remember. Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. Little flying noodle. Oh, I didn't take a picture. Good work, me. <laughs> Revenge. Yes. Okay. Ah. I wish I could capture the feeling of the first time that I saw one of the dragons in Breath of the Wild on my own playthrough because I didn't <laughs> go into the game really knowing much about it. I'd seen some like YouTube thumbnails of like, what is this? And it was like some vague yellow shape, uh, which of course was later uh, Farosh. Um, but the first time I saw the dragon, I'm like, wait, that's allowed? <laughs> what? <laughs> Please just die. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, the the richness of th this world and how much stuff there is in it, stuff that doesn't really get explained until you find it, is very incredible. Uh, yes. And I love it. Um, oh man, I'm so excited for Tears of the Kingdom. My, like, nebulous plan is, uh, when it comes out in May, uh, to, like, play it straight and maybe stream my first go-through. Um, just because... Oh man, I'm so excited for this fucking game. Yeah, I would say maybe don't stream it right out, um, mm -hmm. so that you can like have the experience of the discovery yourself, it's uh, true, and yeah. then like either you know you don't need to to finish the whole game to like start a second playthrough concurrently and like stream that or something. Mm, so. Good point. Yeah, because that's essentially how um, Luda History played God of War was he played ahead to know what was coming and try to plan out the streams, but then didn't finish the game before he started his first stream. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna be the move, I think. Uh, does mean that uh, the audience won't get my immediate, fresh, clean reactions, but honestly, that's fine. Yeah. And also, it's a little easier to avoid spoilers. A little easier to avoid spoilers, yeah. That's a good point, because then I can warn people. <laughs> I've only sometimes approached Divine Beasts before I've, like, activated their quest lines. Well, maybe later. Oh, wait, hold on. This isn't the path. What am I doing? Um, Alright, good. We're going the right way. Uh, but I did do that with Vana Boris on my second playthrough. Uh, I was just kind of in the desert. And, uh... Oh, uh, he stumbled onto it? Yeah. Well, Naboris stumbled onto me. <laughs> um, yeah. Like, the other Divine Beasts, Varuda doesn't move. Varudania does move, but the parts of the volcano he's on, you basically can't get to anyway. Yeah. Uh, now, boomy zoomies. <laughs> yeah. And Va Meadow, uh, is, you know... It doesn't even have collision activated until you start the quest. Um... Vana Boris moves around, and out in the open desert, it, it can kind of catch up with you. <laughs> yeah. It's it's legitimately terrifying. I was, uh... I, hmm? That is the cool thing about Vana Boris, is it's just there. Yeah. It's just there. It's just there. <laughs> tromping around. I actually found that little outpost area that you start the Naboris questline from. Mm -hmm. uh, and the, the Gerudo station there was like, yeah, it's, uh... Oh. 
it's bad. It's, it's bad out there, man. Um, I climbed to the top of the tower and Devoris hit me with lightning. I should introduce you to the king. Hurry, this way! Is it rude to do the shrine before that? Nah, I'm sure he won't mind. Let's go do the shrine. Uh, hello, sir. What's up? Ooh. It's me, I'm called Leto. But enough about me. Oh. I possibly ask you to go and get this king's offer. Ah, okay. Oh. Sure. Ah, <laughs> uh, they won't let me do my side quests yet. Oh, I wonder who that is. Probably not important. Okay, give me that shrine. Yeah. We in. <laughs> Why is chat calling him Fish Hemsworth? <laughs> Okay. Well, we're sitting at $779 donated to uh, more Earthquake Direct Relief, which is very nice. Um, the best uh, two, and we'll go fight that Lionel. Yeah. For 2k, I won't be a weenie. You will also have the entire time I'm sneaking around the Lionel to donate. <laughs> Just uh, imagining, like, oh, you no! sneaking around, but then you hit the donation goal and then just walk out into the open like <laughs> uh. I challenge you I hate this shrine <laughs> oh god it's so annoying maybe I'm just bad at it that's also possible That was not the correct way to do that. Whoops, that was that. Okay, awesome. The gist is you need to uh, arrange ice blocks in this shrine in such a way that the, the balls get like ping-ponged into the correct place uh, so that you can guide down the one important orb to the right spot. But I'm bad at it, and I hate it, so... You need to stasis it at one point. It's just a whole mess. The easiest way to do it is to let it run down and just stasis it at the very end. <laughs> That's what I was thinking, yeah. Oh, cool, the Master Sword's been charged. Thank you. Whoops. Oh, let me get that chest. Or chat will never forgive me. Gimme, give gimme. Give oh, thanks. Okay, cool. Well, I can swap it for one of the crappier Zora Spears. Get out of here. Perfect. All right, we're just gonna let this thing play out. Oh, for God, Link, come on, man. Fine, whatever. What was I expecting? <laughs> Playing as intended. Ha! Good game design. Hoomst. Get out of here. <laughs> Oh boy. No. All right. Well, don't worry. We'll get another one. It's fine. Everything's chill. Oh, I don't like this shrine. I mean, we can warp back here whenever we want. We don't need to do this. I hope King Dora fans okay. It's like, you said the Hylian arrived, right? <laughs> yes, father. <laughs> I don't think I've done most of these Divine Beasts with the Master Sword before. Um, 
And if you don't have it, most of them, after you succeed, will be like, by the way, uh, the sword that seals the darkness might be worth looking <laughs> into. And you're like, yeah, whatevs, old man. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You know, could be fun, could be, oh god, don't, no, 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 wait! Blink! Oh, okay. Whew. All right. Please. Please. Yes. Okay. Whew. Oh, boy. That was a scary one. I'm, I'm not counting the, uh, using the arrow to redirect, uh... Jesus Christ. Come on, man. Uh, as a, a speedrunning strat, because that's just, you know, it's just fun. It's just good sense. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Come on, be nice. Yes, yes, oh, okay, we're good. Phew. All right, how many Sporbs is that? Hold on. Oh, what's up? I gotta take a call. Oh, Back no worries. All right, see you in a bit. All right, blue's gone. Quick, everybody do your best blue, best blue impression. Good one, chat. Nice to see the timeshare on the brain cells working as expected. Yeah. Oh, I need more. I must have more. All right. Let's go talk to King Dorfan. I feel like the only thing I ever parry is guardian lasers. I forget that you can, like, parry other stuff. Good, bro. <laughs> what you doing? Oh, oh. What do you mean? <laughs> Playing dumb, Champion Link. <laughs> Failure again, baby. <laughs> There's no way we'd ask for your help. By the way, Link! How, how are you feeling about me asking for your help? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> okay, where's King Dora, man? Hello. Hi. Hmm. That's it. This highway. I've the feeling I've seen it before. Perhaps a long time ago. How long do you people live? Alright, bye. Oh, there he is. The big boy himself. Slate, and that sword on your back. <laughs> it is all too clear who you are. The highly champion Link. You can't tell me you have forgotten me, her future son in law. You can't mean the Link. Hey, there's been a lot of us. I understand the confusion. 
What a fateful coincidence that we should cross paths. <laughs> we have met numerous times on that, you know. Ah, so many memories. Our land is overflowing with nostalgia, my friend. No hard feelings about the Vifa thing. I've been sleeping a thousand years, it seems. Mm. Again? Sleeping, you say? Well, I mean, I was dead, but we don't need to get into the details. Mm. Surely you must remember my precious daughter, Mifa. Yes, you do. Do you not? Oh, it doesn't even give me the option to be like, sure. <laughs> Mifa who? Presumably Mifa Dorafan. Mm. I cannot mm. believe it. Have you truly forgotten my dear Mifa as well? You and Mifa were so close, yet you do not remember her. I don't understand the running gag in multiple Legend of Zelda games about there being some Zora girl that's really into Link. <laughs> Still not jog your memory? Well, perhaps your memory will return in time. Mm. I dearly hope so. <laughs> huh? Father, I do not believe discussing my sister is helping matters at the moment. Link seems confused. Yeah, a little bit. Mm. Yes, of course. <laughs> the plot. My apologies. How remarkable it is that Saturn brought a champion here without realizing it. That is quite a feat, my boy. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, at least somebody's having fun here. Still, I must ask you to hear my plea. Mm. I must inform you. Zora's domain is in danger of vanishing because the divine beast Rota. Due to courtesy of speaking bluntly, we alone cannot stop this beast. Man, remember when we went to do Va Meadow and the owl guy was like, Hey! Go beat up that bird! And then we left. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi, Vizier Muzu. <laughs> I thought of it curls my fins. Mm -hmm. I expected more of you. How can you still protest? Uh, Muzu, it is rude to speak that way to your king and his guest. <laughs> As you know, Muzu, <laughs> we've already discussed this. Mm. He's a champion through and through. Ah, shucks, you seem great too. Perhaps all of Hyrule is doomed to be swallowed by the sea. Oh, well, everyone likes that game, so it's probably fine. <laughs> Got no my king. We cannot trust these lowly highlands. Hey, look. Our cultural hubris aside, that doesn't mean it's my fault. <laughs> okay, well, that one's a little bit my fault. An endless supply of water. Boy, that sounds busted. It's plagued by heavy rains. All right, what I miss? Who drowned? Uh, nobody yet. Uh, everyone's yelling at me for Mifa. Mm. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Bro, blah, 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 immense damage. Yada, yada. Very near downstream from us. Highland lives are very great danger. King Dorothan's like, Mifa loved you the most. Why were you making eyes at that dumb bird instead? <laughs> <laughs> the Divine Beast is crying out once again. Oh boy. Looking good, girl. Well, that was fun. Anyway, back to being yelled at. Mm. <laughs> Your Princess Zelda often studied the Divine Beasts in the time before the Great Calamity. Yeah, we don't need to get into that right now. <laughs> the orbs located on Ruta's shoulders are mechanisms that can control the water it generates. Ah, oh, thank God that Zelda was such a nerd. We actually have a chance now. <laughs> you hear that? King Rome! <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Or are terribly vulnerable to the power of electricity. Perhaps because we could not safely strike it with enough electricity at once, the water soon returned uh -oh. to its full force. That is why I went in search of a island who could help us! I think I'm certain you've already figured this out, but we need you to use shock arrows to get those orbs working properly again. Please, hero, I beg of you. I, uh... <laughs> what? God, he's friggin' huge! Princess Zelda's still alive? I mean, given definition... She maybe got eaten a little bit. Uh, <laughs> she's alive this whole time, just like you. The events of 100 years ago cannot be altered, it is true. You hear that? Age of Calamity. 
if we can regain control of the divine beasts. Hey, Age Maybe of Calamity was fine. Uh, <laughs> I did not know you had such grand ambitions, Link. Oh, wondrous! Naturally, I shall help too! <laughs> yeah! You can easily climb inside it. Come, Link, let us appease Rooted together. Let's do this! Our goal is the same. That means our meeting was nothing short of destiny. Allow me to offer you this gift as a show of faith. Zora armor! Oh, look, Boozer's so mad! <laughs> So long as you wear this, you can ascend waterfalls, just like Azora. Please take good care of it. <laughs> King Dorfan! What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Countless generations of Zora princesses have sworn, given that armor to the one they've sworn to marry. It's far too important to trust to a shady Hylian. Bro, you guys invited me. <laughs> Mifa had no such relationship with him. <sighs> He's just too much my liege. I do not understand it one bit. Oh, well, there he goes. Mm. Muzu is not easily swayed once his mind is set. He was in charge of educating my dear daughter Miva. He was her teacher and he didn't know that she had like a huge crush on me? <laughs> he didn't see her doodling little Mrs. Mifa hero of Hyrule's in hearts <laughs> on her notebooks? <laughs> <laughs> once I can hear this high bridge rudeness. Mm -hmm. But what shall we do now? Now he's rushed off in a huff. Oh. Link, do not let his words concern you. I will work this out with Muzu. I shall return shortly. Well, we could always go to, uh, Rito's domain and, um, buy shock arrows. <laughs> but, uh, I suppose that means you were going to tell him. Mm. Like, Muzu's most likely the square down below. Would you mind going down there? I just love the drama. <laughs> All right. Great. Let's go talk to the manta ray guy that hates us. Whee! Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Alright. Hold on, I'm going to have a conversation with this guy who hates me. I need someone big and strong to be my emotional support. <laughs> I need you to stand behind me and, like, pat me on the shoulder if it looks like I'm faltering, because I really, I really just need this. Muzu, please listen. I don't care what you say. Oh, the drama, the tension, the sizzling chemistry. Alright, what's the haps, bros? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Hello! I love that Link always does the little wave thingy. I have no desire to speak with you. Mm. Listen well, Muzu. There's something you need to know. He who stands here, the man called Link, is the one whom my sister Mipha had feelings for. <gasps> no way! <laughs> Link is Hyrule Champion XX? <laughs> <laughs> I was only a child then, adorably chibi and bobbleheaded, so I did not know it myself at the time. But it is so. <laughs> I totes read her diary, and boy, there's some spicy stuff in there. <laughs> You know that bit in Turning Red where she draws the, the corner store guy as a mermaid? It's basically just that for like 500 pages. <laughs> what? No! You cannot fool me with such a fanciful lie. Not this, Sora. How could Lady Mifa possibly have feelings for a Hylian like him? Look at him, he's grotesque! No head fins! <laughs> his legs are all long and shit! <laughs> he doesn't even have a shark on his head! <laughs> Who's ever in Mifa's heart? Oh shit, really? Well now I feel like a dick telling her dad I didn't remember her. <laughs> There's no way this could be <laughs> Mifa's one true love, appointed knight underscore XD kill 6969. <laughs> <laughs> what other dumbass gamer tags would Link have? <laughs> I think every Link has a different dumbass gamer tag. Yeah. But I also feel like this Link is the most professional of them. So, like, Twilight Princess Link would be like Werewolf Cowboy 69XX, uh, but like this Link would be like Appointed Knight 1147. Yeah. Always yeah. getting yourself just a reckless child. I want to know how this guy was friends with the Zora Princess before he became the Appointed Knight. Right there was a there was a Hylian Zora exchange program. <laughs> So Link did, um, did late primary school in Zora's domain. <laughs> I guess. I was always willing to heal your wounds. Oh. Even back then. XX Twink Gamer XX. <laughs> <laughs> it's Skyward Sword. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Thanks, girl. So if this calamity Ganon does in fact return, what can we really do? We just don't seem to know much about what we'll be up against. Well, thank God Princess Zelda's but really hitting the books on this one. That no matter how difficult this battle might get, 
if you if anyone ever tries to do you harm I'll fucking kill them <laughs> and then heal you no matter when or how bad the wound I hope you know that I will always protect you once this whole thing is what's over, that meme about like link gets down to one heart and Mifa as a ghost is just like shaking in energetic <laughs> anticipation <laughs> Perhaps we could spend some time together. So I choose on, to believe do it. that do Link. It. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I choose to believe that Link did not process <laughs> that Mifa had a huge ass crush on him. I think this is just as much of a surprise to him as everyone else. <laughs> What's the matter, Link? Are you unwell? Uh. <laughs> like a hatchling. Oh, yeah, they must hatch from little eggs. That's cute. Mifa, I remember. She was down bad. Considering how watery this domain is, it's amazing how thirsty she was. <laughs> There's no way you remembered her just now when it is most convenient. Eh, you'd be surprised. In any case, without solid proof, I cannot possibly take you at your word. If you have any such proof, now is the time to show it. Do so and, and I shall tell you how you got those shock arrows. This as well as anything else you wish to know. She was the champion of Zora and of Simps. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she she really seems the type to not actually be like, hey, you want to be like boyfriend, girlfriend? <laughs> I genuinely feel that she'd be like, it, I'll, I'll just make him the armor that you make for the guy you're going to marry. And then not tell Zelda that like, <laughs> that I get my power by thinking about how studly he is. Uh, <laughs> All right, let's talk, bro. You see this? You see this drip? You see this perfectly tailored fit? That's the best evidence I can provide you, old man. Huh. Sidon's like, incorrect, you're still wearing pants. <laughs> Link, I think in order to complete the illusion, <laughs> you're gonna need to get those off. <laughs> eh? What in the... That is the Zora armor from before! Did you just fully change in front of me? <laughs> Lady Mifa made that by hand, and yet it fits you perfectly. She really knew your measurements, that... You really didn't <laughs> figure this out before? <laughs> what is the meaning of this? <sighs> now you understand, do you not? Now you know who her heart belonged to, and who she made this special armor for. I always thought it was weird that it would not fit a single Zora, on account of how <laughs> weird and thin it is. The fact that Zora fits Link perfectly should be proof enough that Mifa made it for him, and him alone. I don't know, you'd be surprised. Like, the barbarian armor I found at the bottom of this, like, 10,000-year-old ruin also fits me perfectly. Hmm. That's why Mifa never told Link you. Link actually has racist. excellent tailor skills. Yeah, he just always does a little nip and a tuck and takes it in. You must promise to help him save us all, Buzu. Mifa didn't tell you, because you're racist against pretty elf boys. <laughs> the worst kind of racism in all fantasy literature. I never would have imagined she would make that special armor for one such as he. But honestly, all those dreamy sighs do make a little more sense now. I do not approve of asking for help from a Hylian, but I suppose it is our only option at this point. Future son-in-law, basically. <laughs> <laughs> Means I must take responsibility for my unwarranted behavior towards you. As promised, I shall tell you where you can collect as many shock arrows as you will need. Mm. That tall mountain over yonder. It is called Ploymus Mountain, and there you will also find Shatterback Point. There you will meet with Yoda, the Jedi that trained <laughs> me. <laughs> mm. Aha! You must mean that Lionel. He's a man-beast, that one. And I would know from man-beasts. Anyway, Beast does indeed wield shock arrows. That is certainly one way to collect them quickly. He's vicious, to be sure. But I'm certain Link will rise to the challenge, because I'm pretty sure he did that again, like, a hundred years ago. I estimate you will need, hmm, at least 20 shock arrows. Do you think you can gather that many? I don't know, that's kind of up to Chad, isn't it? We've hit 1K. You know what to do, folks. I've no doubt he will be triumphant. Hmm. Okay, Link, let's get moving. The fastest way to play with men is to send the waterfall east of the domain. That Zora armor should come in handy. Just swim to the waterfall basin and then go up the waterfall from there. All the way to East Reservoir Lake, right by the Divine Beast. I'm on it! <laughs> Wonderful! Together we shall stop that Divine Beast onslaught. <laughs> just like, mm. Am I the only one who remembers the dead princess? <laughs> Two sentiments from chat. One is, why is it called Shatterback Point? Is that is that a thing? Uh, and the other one is someone noticed that uh, Sidon is wearing a choker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Guys, all of the Zora are doing that. <laughs> oh, God. 
All right, where is that waterfall? I think it's that one. Hey, buddy, you still mad? You're acting so cold and unconcerned about the harm that befell Lady Mifa. I just got here, and my face just does that. It's too late now. I shall be the one to shoot Ruta down. So it was decided by the Zora Council. Just stay out of my way. So, uh, <laughs> should I take the shock arrow? <laughs> Stop the cycle of self-harm? No taxi faxies Whoops, okay. They won't let me leave. Oh, I'm in the middle of my shock arrow training. I must learn to withstand them. Did I not just tell you that? To commit such violence with the great Sagan standing right before you. In that case, you take the responsibility of appeasing the divine beast, Ra Ruta. Huh. Aw, oh, shucks. All right, well. Oh, take shock. care of yourself, old man. Put some ice on that, baby. All right, adventure! Aw, oh, shocks. <laughs> if I say it loudly and again, it'll be funny. <laughs> That's how uh, I told my jokes in high school. Yeah. And it didn't work. That's the number one rule of comedy. <laughs> Everything's funnier when you say it again. Hello. Ooh. Yes, sir. East gate is all clear, sir. There's a gate here? I've not been paying attention. Da da da. No. Oh! Well, if it isn't Master Link! Aren't you a sight for sore eyes? Oh, finally! Someone who's happy to see me! We used to play together all the time. My name is Gannison. Mm -hmm. Highland that Prince Ivan brought here. Don't tell me that was you, Master Link. Mm -hmm. And what's more, you don't seem to have changed much in the last 100 years. Oh, but I should be making idle chit-chat just now. Oh my Dude. gosh, Blue Cat, $900 donation. Uh, Holy all right. crap! Well, we did it! Uh, okay, wow. let's go fight Thank the you all Lionel! So much. <laughs> We're gonna go fight the Lionel. We're gonna go fight that Lionel, baby. After that, I will have to uh, depart uh, for the day. I've got to do some some side tasks. Uh, uh, cool. And we've got to do some side on tasks. <laughs> okay, let's go. So unfortunately, uh, there are things you have to do aside from video work, which I was not aware of, and it's I a complete know. scam. We really it's like thought you have to we make your cars to get inspected, <laughs> so that they're like up to code Bye. or some nonsense. Mm. <laughs> because they have to be safe, safe and working in good proper order, and not belting out tons of poisonous chemicals into the atmosphere. I love when you can more just than hear cars usually do. Yeah. You know, it's, the, it's only the permitted amount of toxic chemicals. Remember when Volkswagen uh, got caught for running a extremely complex grift where they were rating their diesel cars as way cleaner than they actually were? Yep. That was pretty fucked, that wasn't was, it? <laughs> that sure was something. And shit like that is why it is actually important to get your vehicle regularly inspected. Yep. sign. That's what I call environmental storytelling. Alright, let's, um... Well, if we're gonna be fighting a Lionel... Let's put on... Oh, I can't believe the Guardian armor is not my best armor right now. Oh, well, I need to upgrade it more, that's why. You need to take it to the fairies so they can, like, kiss it or whatever they well, do. They've actually already been upgraded once, uh, oh, but I need to upgrade them again so they can get it to 12. I think I just need more guardian parts for that, so we might do Forgotten Temple 2 Electric Boogaloo later today. Uh, but first we must free Divine Beast Varuta. Uh, let's see, what else do we got? Um, got the Master Sword. Let's, uh... What's a good shield for this? I know the Hylian shield deflects guardian lasers, apparently. Um... Or, like, can't be damaged by them, which is pretty cool. Uh, I just don't want to break it, because it's important to me. <laughs> um, hmm. Well, I kind of don't want to get killed, so I guess we're going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, not doing this the stealthy way is going to be a nice change from my normal approach. What ho, beast!
<laughs> Come on, Link. You know what chat said. Yeah! Ha ha! Oh, already this is going well. Oh, wow! Wow, this is going really well! <laughs> Getting the timing window perfect. I guess? Use that champion ability. Whoop! Ah, whoops! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, we're fine. I just fell down the cliff a little bit. Hey, 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 I'm not doing this on purpose! <laughs> That looks like it could have taken you way ah! further down. <laughs> you were solidly in free fall Stop there. Stop shooting arrows at me! I want to fight you! There we go. Sheesh. Oh, okay, cool. Uh. Hey, bud, guess what this is? Whoops. <laughs> Ask where I got this from. Oh, ho, ho. hang on, can I? Yes. Oh, get dunked on, sir. Whoops. Perhaps it is I who am about to get dunked on. Should I heal? No, it's the children who are wrong. Whoops. <laughs> Ow! Sir, it's very rude. Do you just go under his arm? <laughs> no, this is like the... It's the thing that... Oh, the little side dodge? Yeah, I'm not entirely sure how that one works, but it, it does that. It looks like he swung, like, fully over you. I'm not entirely sure. Whoops. <laughs> Hard to get those quick headshots. Oh, whoops. Are you at Broski? Whoop, there he is. Oh, he's speedy. Yeah! Come on, buddy! Yeah! Woo! Oh, boy! It does get easier with practice. Yeah. Nice. Ah, okay. oh, hold on. I dropped some of my crappier things. Well done. Alright, let's get rid of, uh... Mm, whoop, nope. And uh, yeah, let's let's replace my old and busted Lionel shield with a new Lionel shield. Old and busted, new hotness. And let's get rid of this crappy traveler's bow and get the yeah, yeah. All right, how many? All right, we need a couple more shock arrows, but we have the run of the place now. Whew, that was fun. <laughs> We have enough now, but uh, we know that my ability to hit targets precisely during tense situations uh, is dubious at times, so we'll just get a couple extra, you know, surprise tools. To I think there. you did great. Thank you. <laughs> nice. Alrighty. A couple more. Always fun. Link comes down with a bundle of 20 Lionel arrows, or 20 electric arrows, and a whole Lionel pelt just yeah. draped over like tape. Yeah, and like, uh, Hercules Link, style. what happened? Uh, no big. Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right, let's see. We got any more of them shock arrows? Right. 
with that, I will have to go um, do all the other things that today is, is calling for me to do. Of course. But uh, have fun. Thank you. Uh, let me know how the rest of it goes. Will do. Um, have fun with the uh, grown-up car responsibilities, the... I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I have to actually finish Friday's video. Oh, heck yeah. Detail that. Diatribe. It's a fun one. Yeah. Um, I'm excited for this uh, I'm looking at a lot. I got it edited time-wise, so now I just need to decide how much of this hour and 15 minutes I want to fill with example footage. <laughs> um, there's some scenes that I will put in, like, just full scene clips, but I don't think I'll be able to illustrate every little bit, because this game is long. It's a long boy. That's a lot of gigabytes of files. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, have fun! Alright, bye friends, All right. and I will see you next time. Bye! Alright, give me just a sec, squad. Let me close out Discord. Where we're going, we won't need it anymore. Okay, let's get back to business. Whew. I should probably eat something. Yeah, yeah just a little bit. You know, just a skosh, just a smidge. Yeah, it can't hurt to have more hearts where we're going. Oh, man. Oh, there's like four in this tree. <laughs> oh, hello? Jump at your own risk. Oh. Uh, just a second. Hello? Hi. Uh, you just had a thousand dollar donation about three seconds after I left. I oh my god! <laughs> um, okay. Uh, wow, uh, thanks for that. I, yeah, I gotta, I forgot, I ne uh, without you watching chat, I need to have the stream up so I can keep an eye on the comments. Um. <laughs> yeah, like, I literally, I, I closed out, I went to go, like, X out of the, the, the video, um, like, stream setup place in YouTube. And I just saw, like, uh, Anonymous donated $1,000. I'm like, uh, holy fuck. Wow. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah. Thanks. Um... <laughs> All right. Cool. Bye. All right. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Now he's got... Eh, quit that out again. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Oops. Sorry. Hmm. You know what, gang? I don't think we're gonna jump off Shatterback Point, because I feel like that's a bad idea. But we did just get one thousand dollars. No, no, we're too smart. <laughs> we're too smart for this, damn it. Um. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, oh shit! Is that a shrine? Hello. Huh. Something for later, maybe. All right. Back to business. Whoops. <laughs> Ah. Hello, sir. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That's going to be a toughie, my friend. Hold on, let me just set a couple things. There's surprise tools that'll help us later. And I'm sorry, guys, for this one, the gun show might have to go away. I think we might actually have to swim up waterfalls for this part. <laughs> ah. All right. What's up, my dude? Hmm. Glad to see you're ready to go, Link. Ha! Hmm. You ready for this? You have your Zora armor and enough shock arrows? I'm ready. <laughs> Wonderful. You never cease to amaze, Link. Let's go and appease that divine beast as one. Here we go. Whee! Oh, yeah, I can't swim that fast. Hmm. Gaze now upon the divine beast's back. Do you see those glowing pink orbs? Did you shoot each of them with a shock arrow? Your 
Zora armor, you now have the ability to ascend waterfalls. I shall take you right up to the side of the Divine Beast, and from there you can swim up and take aim. I know you can do it. I believe in you. Now hurry up and get on my back. I'm ready. <laughs> I thought you'd never ask. Let's get going. Oh. Here we go. Ha! Huh. I'm unstoppable in the water. God, I hope he's a tear in the kingdom. Uh-oh. Ooh, he's getting big mad. Keep going. At full speed! It's a few to ward off Luda's attacks. I'll do my best, bro. <clears throat> Ancient and mysterious powers against us. It includes hurling giant ice blocks that we need to watch out. I shall leave those to you. Whoops. Oh god. Oh god. Damn you, motion controls! And yet it's still better than the alternative. Hold on. Sorry. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Are the correct arrows equipped? No, I don't. Wow, I got so many shotguns. Oh. Here we go. Oh, oh boy. Right. Ah! Can I do it? No. Oh boy. Watch that ice. Stop it. Stop it. Shock arrows ready. Oh boy. Stress, the tension, the chemistry. This is my one. Ah, I did get that one. Nice. Marvelous. I should probably go back. I don't think it lets you. Oh my god! Oh boy. We moved out. Whoopsie. We're getting close. You need to go around the other side, buddy. We already did this one. <laughs> okay, sure. I guess I'll swim upward on this one. This one is like maybe not as intended. I wonder if it would let me land on it. You know what? Let's not find out. Thanks, bud. I try. Oh, it's sad now. Good work, team. Mission accomplished. We want to venture inside it, right? Uh, wanted to might be a strong word. Drive me closer. I want to hit them with my sword. Oh, so pretty. Well, Link, here we are. Looks like this is where the real work starts. Best of luck. Nice job cutting off the water flow from this divine beast. Thanks, man. I try. Show the enemy no fear. Show no fear. I'll see fear. you back at Zora's domain. Farewell. Goodbye. Oh, looks like me and the elephant are going for a ride. as long as he's having fun. I really hope that in Tears of the Kingdom we get all the uh, next generation champions turning up. So Sidon and Teba and the, the one for the Gorons and um, uh, the one for the Gerudo whose names escape me. Anyway, they're all really fun. Whoop. You're here. Oh. I must say that I am so
so happy to see that this day has finally arrived. Now, Ruta can be freed of Ganon's control. You'll need a map to prevent you from getting lost. The Guidance Stone there contains the information that you will need. All right, let's go, girls. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Back to regular arrows. No need to waste the good stuff. Until later, when I inevitably do. Away! Oh, excuse me. Somebody needs to be... Whoop. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's the eyeball. Ah, weak sauce. Okay. Let's try this. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Waste not want not, you know what they say. Ah, okay. I feel like this is already a more creative environment design than Vomito. <laughs> you know? It's already, like, you, you need to already cycle through runes to make stuff happen. <clears throat> Red seems a bit overpowered. Yeah, this is the Divine Beast you're supposed to do first. Um, we've already gotten some of the stuff that you're kind of... You know what, it's fine. Uh, the control's been enabled. Good. You've obtained the map of the Divine Beast. Heck yeah. You will see several glowing points on your map which represent the terminals that control Ruta. Take Ruta back by activating all of the terminals. I'll do my best, girl. Be careful. <laughs> I, I don't want to be rude, Mifa, but I kind of went and did Revali's first, so I sort of know the gist. You did Revali's first? Oh, that's that's okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm not upset. <laughs> all right, let's see. Uh, deal with you later. Right, let's see. Give me the jingle before I've done it. Don't patronize me. There we go. There are four terminals remaining. Don't give up. I wasn't planning on it, Mifa. Thanks for telling me. Okay, let's see. This big chamber area scene. Oh. All right. Uh, we'll deal with that later. We'll see how far we can get right now. Nice view, though. Let's try this. Here it comes. There it is. Okay. Oh, cool. We got the Master Sword back again. Did 
something just get oh, something's farting the bad guys, I can hear it. Nope, Link, no. Dang it. Great. Okay, well, let's try that again. Ah, so much stuff is happening. Okay. Let's see. Terminals remaining. You can do it. Thank you, Mifa. Let's see. Okay, I see. Well, that didn't do what I wanted, but we can take care of a couple things while I'm here anyway. Nice! Yeah, the easiest thing to do probably would have just been to, um, stop it from spinning by moving the trunk again, because I keep forgetting the mechanics of these dungeons. <laughs> Ugh! It's emergent gameplay. It's good game design. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. get up on that walkway. God damn it, Link. <laughs> Fine, whatever. I'm tired of climbing these ramps. Two terminals remaining. You're nearly there. Yeah. Oops. All right, let's see. Where are we going? All right, there's one in the head and one on the trunk. So we want... Ah, okay. Okay. Well, I think there's an intended way to do this. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, why not? Ooh, 
Hello. Treasure chest. I'll take that. Wow, thanks. Okay, whatever. Where'd that thing go? Where are you hiding? Okay, whatever. <laughs> Sir. Wow, these things really don't last very long, do they? Wait, was that my other Lionel sword? Yeah, that was my older Lionel sword. Okay, never mind. We're good. Phew, so I can get back easily. Nice. All right. Let's see. What are we doing? Let's get there. Focus. I think there's a way you're supposed to get the one on the end of the trunk, but I feel like I always get it by sort of, like, glitching the physics engine a little bit. Because, <laughs> like... Because there's basically a certain angle at which, uh, like, Sheikah made platforms become impossible to climb, but you can sort of just, whoop, you can sort of just cheese your way up. <laughs> Come on, buddy. See? <laughs> like, that's the, that's the tipping point. The terminal's on the other side. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna do this by degrees. <laughs> you good, bro? Easy. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, we're fine. Everything's chill. I mean, you know, the real answer is that we're gonna just wait for Revali scale to reset, and then we're just gonna floosh our way up. It's gonna be fine. But you know. This is another way to do it. Oh, buddy! Oh, man! Oh, we were so close. Oh, you know what? I bet if we swim up that waterfall, it'll give us the height boost we need to paraglide onto that. <laughs> yep, there it is. Ooh, there it almost is. Oh, cruel. Cruelty. Jail for mother. Okay, what to do? This is the line already open, right? Oh, it's not. Oh, wait, yeah, damn it. Okay, whatever. <laughs> uh, well, first things first, we can certainly... Quite. 
Oh, that's about right. Maybe? No. Oh, there might be like a... Open now that I think about it. <sighs> what to do? Well, maybe I could just swim up that waterfall. Can I? Not glass. I'm misled. Perhaps even bamboozled. <laughs> well, that's okay. We're about to get Rivali's Gale back and like. 30 seconds, so we'll just use that. <laughs> Gameplay as intended, who? <laughs> Good game design, what? Nah, we're in this for. We're in this to win this, baby. Let's make sure. Are those the only two terminals left? Yep, on the right above us, and then the one in the trunk. Yeah, we'll be fine. Oh yeah, <laughs> okay. So we'll just kill 47 seconds, then we'll see what to do. Ah! Yep, we got, we got sneaky sneaky gears up there we need to use. That's why it was putting us fire. So how are you guys doing? I should think of a 4k reward. Something for maybe after Vavruva, uh, because let's be honest, I don't think this is going to take us crazy long. Rivali's Gale is now ready. Thanks, Rivali. <laughs> let's get down to business, baby. Whoop. Oh, oh, little high, little high. Uh, but uh, good effort. Love the, love the enthusiasm. Who's the man? God damn it. Damn it, Rivali. This is why we can't have nice things. Okay, there we go. We are good. We're good. Let's kill whatever this thing is. Where's the eyeball? There you are. Oh. Awesome. Okay. There we go. Okay. Now. Uh, like there, maybe? Oh, nope. Nope. Too far. Other way. Let's try that. Whoop. Nice. Awesome. Okay, let's go. Just one terminal remaining. I have faith in you. Yeah. Okay, let's see. That's the best way to get to the top of the trunk. Well, I don't know. From here, we'll splash us into a wall, so probably not that. Also do that. Okay. Okay. Okay, good place to I'm not sure what that hole was for. All right, let's see. Is that too far? That might be too far. Oh, you know what? Lower is actually better. Let's try that. Actually, I think we're fine. Let's, uh... Careful. Yeah, 
full. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. You activated all the terminals. Now you can start the main control unit. Don't worry, nothing bad's there gonna happen. There should be a new glowing mark on your map. Head there. Will do, girl. Be careful not to let your guard down. Why is something bad gonna happen? Well, I mean, while we're up here. Some eyeballs, maybe? Get that treasure chest, perhaps? You know, just clean the place up. Like, what? what? Hold on. Ah, okay. I... Oh! Oh, my bow broke! I was trying to figure out why it wouldn't let me shoot this thing. Well. <laughs> Awesome. Super worth it. <laughs> hey, Revali, bud, you want to recharge, like, now? It'd be super helpful. Huh. I was not expecting that to work. Or that. Oh, that, that might be a bridge too far. Oh, yeah! Yeah! Alright, this better be good. Nice. Oh. Hello over there. <laughs> hey, bud. Alright, anyway, back to business. Going mark on map. Boss fight. I mean, uh, nothing to worry about. Oh, you know what we should do? I mean, you know, we're gonna be fighting a scary blight. We gotta Gotta be decked out in our finest. Oh, sick, another treasure chest. Hell yeah. This is going great. Sweet, a hundred bucks. Alrighty. I see absolutely no downsides to this plan. Sudden moon inevitable betrayal. Oh, I gotta get a picture of this one. Girl. As much of a fight as I could, but it proved to be my demise 100 years ago. Regardless, <laughs> I believe that you are well prepared for this moment. Thanks, girl. Thanks, one of us. All right. Now, uh. All right. Say yeah, cheese, big fella. Yeah! <laughs> oh, beautiful. All right. Whoop. Ooh, it does have a long range. I see what you mean. Ooh. 
So, allegedly you can parry those? Let's try it, actually. Hold on, wait, hold on, wait, wait, time out, hold on. <laughs> ah, I see. Hey, big man. You know what, what am I doing? Let's just shoot him in the eye a whole bunch. That never goes badly. Doesn't do as much damage as it did to uh, Bombay. That's okay. Go now. But I am trying, okay? He always falls a little far away. Oops, second phase. Thanks, Mipha. I noticed. Okay. There you go. Oh, right on top of me, looks like. Hey, big fella. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh, good. I got it. I know how this works. Nope. None of that from you. Down you come. down here. Face me! Alright, what was my time, guys? How long did that take? <laughs> oh, he's got like a little seahorse face. I never noticed that. It's kind of cute, actually. got Mipha's heart. Put it next to Rivali's heart. <laughs> I'm sure they'll get along great. Warp. Yeah! Alright, let's go, guys. You guys are going to get my favorite music in a minute. Yes. Whoops. Hello, Lin. Because of your courage, my spirit is now free. And Rita as well. Thank you. For I am now allowed by this freedom to be with you once again. Oh. Since I am now a spirit, my healing power would be wasted on you. I have no need of it. So therefore, I would like you to have it. Please accept. Mipha's grace. <laughs> Yesterday, I was awash in a pool of tears. I had nearly given up hope and resigned myself to being trapped here as a spirit mm -hmm. for the rest of eternity. Oh. But now you're here. All this time, my hope was to see you once more. 
promise me that you will not hesitate to call upon my power if you ever find yourself in need. Knowing that will let my spirit rest in peace. Mm -hmm. I must go. Ruta and I have our roles to fulfill. We are both honored to be able to play the role of support. I mean, there are no small parts, girl. We'll annihilate Ganon Just together. Actors. Yeah, let's Farewell. kill him. Save her, Link. Save the princess. Save Princess Zelda. Well, that's the plan. working on it. There we go. Questions about the logistics of this. Oh. <laughs> it's doing a little mermaid swoosh on the rock thing. <laughs> Ravali, nice to see you. Ah, uh, Mifa. Good, good talk. <laughs> and the other champions, of course. Ruta, you literally made me like a let's get married shirt. I think the crush is out of the bag. Using your ability to drain Ganon of his power is key to our success. This is it. This will be our last chance. And everyone's last hope. If we seal him away, then we can restore peace to Hyrule. And both your duty and mine will be fulfilled. Father, are you well, I wonder? I want you to know I have always followed my heart. I'm sorry I made you worry. I wish I could see you again. Even just once more. God. All the other champions are kind of okay with the situation. Mifa's really the only one that's just devastating. <laughs> I wonder if I use Mipha's grace inside on her King Dora fan's presence, will they be like, holy shit, wait, what? <laughs> wait, come back! Alright, who do I gotta talk to? Hello, sir. You seem nice. Now tell me. Master Link! Oh, hello. Is it true you, the Hyrian champion? It's me! Riven! Oh, my best friend Riven! That sounds familiar. Mm. Should you be dead? Sorry, that may be too personal a question. Well, funny story about that. Mm. <clears throat> Father. <laughs> All right, sorry. Mm. <laughs> oh, they're all so nice. I want to know why Link hung out with the Zora so much. Like, what kind of childhood did he have? Hello. You mad? 
Prince si yeah, Prince Sidon was able to stop Rudo, definitely. What's wrong? Oh no, don't have a side quest. God damn it. Oh right, okay. What are the odds? It would turn out to be Link. Pretty good. I'm I'm kind of popular. Wait. Uh oh. Thanks, Jim Redling. You've gone and made me forget about the tried die drop. Damn it! It is a side quest. What do I do now? Nope. All right, I'm done talking to people. Where you at, King Dora fan? We gotta talk. I did it. I've been waiting to return. It's all a little more than a bad dream now. Wow, you brought the whole squad out to say thank you. I could have ever expected from you. Link, I most sincerely apologize for my harsh treatment to you. Oh, it's Muzu. <laughs> that whole time you were thinking of Hyrule and Lady Muzu's well-being, just like the rest of us. Well, yeah. Perhaps racism really is bad. <laughs> if I did your heart to forgive me, then perhaps one day. I must reward your efforts. Collect the treasure inside that chest over there. Mm. I see you've already awakened the sword that seals the, seals the darkness. Perhaps you do not have needed this after all. I've never seen this before. What you have there is a legendary blade that only you can wield. You must take great care of it. <laughs> so don't hit rocks with it is what I'm hearing. You two side on. <gasps> Parental approval. Yeah. Your father, I'm proud of you for fighting the divine beast alongside Link. You've grown much recently. I know he will be a worthy heir when the time comes. I want you to marry Link. Huh. He'd be make. He'd like make the best son-in-law. Like we all know this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ah, we're besties. Hmm. Thank you so much. Will you marry me? <laughs> All right. Anyway, this calls for a top-tier expression of gratitude. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. Th okay. Thanks. All right. All right. Yep. We're good. <laughs> I like that in Zelda's diary. She's like, "Yeah, Link doesn't talk because he has social anxiety," and then they're like. Quick, three cheers for Link! Everyone look at him right now! Oh, yeah, thank- No, I- uh, Okay. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Link, there's something I wish to ask you. Oh, no. Your journey with Enruta to the Divine Beast of Water. Now you're back, but Mitha has still yet to- I don't know how to tell you this, my man. Mm -hmm. Is it as I- Wait! You didn't know- you Oh, my God. God, that didn't even occur to me. Because Zora can live that long. <laughs> oh, God! Wow, that was crushing. Uh, let's, uh, get, get, get the fuck out of here. Who has got time for that? Nice. Wow, okay, that was devastating. Uh, okay, let's, let's get back in gear. <laughs> Whoops. No, it's not that. God damn it. There we go. Perfect. Whew! Alright. What to do? Wow, that was, uh... That was rough. Um, okay, well, we're in Zora's domain. We've, uh, we've, we've freed Varuda. There she is. Just chillin'. There's a few things we can do. I think we can collect the other pieces of the Zora armor. Um, shopping, get that shrine. Um, wow, I 
can't believe I never tried to talk to King Dorofan after that. I had no idea that they were hiding the absolute most painful thing they could think of there. <laughs> oh, where are you going, Sidon? What you looking at? <laughs> All to help save our home. Unless you want a treasure of a Hylian. Ah, oh, shucks. Yep. Huh. Yep. Well, the pushy on him. No, Sidon. That's what makes you so charming. Mm. Huh. Have I mentioned how incredible you are? And how thankful I am? Ah, oh, huh. shucks. Gosh. Well, you're just incredible. Uh, have fun with your dead sister statue. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, what, what do we got? Rivali's Gale is now ready. Not now, Rivali. <laughs> um, yeah, I think we're okay. Yeah, what is? Losa. Hi, <laughs> Champion Link. Okay. Oh, neat. Oh, what's up with you, my dude? Is your name ended son by any chance? No. Okay. You're a Hylian, aren't you? It's rare to see your kind around here. I was roaming nearby during my travels, and Prince Sidon recruited me and brought me here. It's because I can touch shock arrows, but I also weigh, well, a lot. There's no way I'll be able to carry you on my back. That's what Prince Sidon said to me. That was kind of rude of him, wasn't it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. That's rough. Well, we can't all be twinks. Being sad or just posing? Alright. Well, let's, let's get whatever the shrine quest this is. Hello! A scale of light. <laughs> oh shucks, thanks. Th yeah, that, that's fair. What's that song? Uh huh. Yes, I want to hear it. Do it. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. I think I remember this one confusing me, because if I recall correctly, you need the ceremonial trident and not the real light scale trident. It's kind of a pain. Yeah, let's just uh, let's just move around here. I should think of something for 4K. Um, hmm, I got the Master Sword. We're at two out of four Divine Beasts. Hmm. Uh, I could do more Terry Town progress. That's always fun. Hello, got a side quest. Um, what's up, Frank? It's you, Link. I'm sorry. I was talking to myself. What's wrong? Uh. My wife may left and hasn't come back yet. Oh, uh. I'll find her. Oh. Well, I'll, I'll do my best. Oh, this guy's got a side quest, I think. This one's actually fun. Oh, you were mad at me? Oh, it's like, uh, seems I was wrong about you. Oh, sorry, I didn't introduce myself sooner. So what, what does, hello? Oh. 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 Turn out to be pretty incredible that, thanks. What's the deal? Ah, <laughs> uh, sure. 
piece of fish cake. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, why not? Okay. Where's that one? That one I, I don't mind doing. Um. Yeah, okay. Why not? Oh, we can also see if we can find the, uh, the lights, the, the ceremonial trident. Nice. Alright, let's just, uh, what, what can we drop? Um, probably this one. Layers. Alright. stones around here, actually. We want to get more sweet cash monies. Let's see. Where's that really mad guy? Drop the circle and try it. He's gotta be around here somewhere. <laughs> I think I'm trying to cheese this without starting the side quest, but meh. I know there's a sword. I I don't need that sword. The Zora sword is like pretty looking, and I like a good one-handed weapon, but it is not particularly good, and now that we have the master sword, we kind of don't really need it that much. But a good shield, I go through those things constantly, so can't hurt to have. The journey was worth it. Nice. All right. What else can we do? Huh? There's a ladder. Zora's domain? If I just, uh, yep, okay, cool. Well, I just reinvented the wheel, that was fun. Um, alright, let's see. Oh, now he has a side quest. This is the Hylian, the appeased Ruta. I don't express how grateful I am. I'm still feeling the ramifications oh. of the chaos. Oh, yes, Frank. Materials? Yeah. Repairs require a large number of luminous stones. There are plenty of them around Upland Zorana. Zorana. <laughs> if you have ten of them, that would be a big help. Uh, I keep selling them, so I don't think I have ten. Oh, yeah. But if I find more, I'll certainly send them your way, because he will give us as many diamonds as we want, uh, basically. There's Trello. Oh! Oh, wait, we don't have enough, uh... We don't have enough spores for the goddess statue to be of any help. Oh well. Oh, already gave us the killing the Hinox thing. Yeah, he's just depressed. Oh, yeah, we'll deal with him later. Why not? Uh, what? Uh, <laughs> hmm. Uh, all right. Well, this is awkward. Um, wow, we have a lot more memories to go. Where's my... Did I not... Have I really never... 
Damn it. And we killed it. No! Alright. Well, next blood moon or next Lionel, I guess. We go take a photo. Ugh, oh, I should have known. Ah. Oh. What's up, you old grouch? I hated you with all my heart. Bro, I've been napping. Ah, great. That was not what I wanted. It's a ceremonial trident. Whatever. <sighs> what else do we gotta do? Um. Well, we could go. Kill the Hinox. Look for stone monuments. Gather some luminous stones. Well, a lot of those are just a good idea to do in general. Um. You know what? Let's uh, let's just do a little bit of exploring around. See if we can find some more stone monuments. I think they're easier to spot uh, at night because they glow a little bit. Right up here. Doesn't look like it. Okay. <laughs> Whoops. Nope. Come on, Link. Yeah. All right. Just futz around. What should we do for 4K? Um, hmm. Setting anything to do with dragons as a reward is a little bit tough because they tend to just sort of show up when they want to, uh, which we don't have much say in. Uh, hmm. <laughs> either chat, but we need to swim with waterfalls sometimes. Um, maybe for 4k we'll go to, uh, we'll do the next chunk of Terrytown, because I sort of have secret foreknowledge of the future where those Gorons uh, that Hudson wanted are, um, and I think we can get there without catching fire. This is nice. What's over here? Oh, but I, yeah, okay, hold on, let me go. Ah. Hey! I knew that was somewhere, I didn't remember it was here. Nice! Alright, let's, uh, let's see if we can figure out, where's that dude? Oh, down a waterfall? Hmm, I don't know if we want to deal with that. Oh, cool, we've we reached the Akala region from the back way. Yeah, let's not fuzz with that right now. Um, I don't know where the pants are. They gotta be somewhere. Bits. Nice. Alright, we don't need the rest of that. Wow. 
Oh yeah, there it is. The Akala Citadel. Oh, Lionel picture his pants? Perfect. Whoop! Excuse me? Oh, just regular arrows? Okay, I see how it is. Alright, but it needs to be a red Lionel. So we can't just get a, one of the spooky ones from, uh, from the Hebrew region and call it a day. Which is a shame. guys gonna do oh come on all right fine whatever <laughs> cool all right oh he's confused oh jeez This area is a quest place uh, when you're doing the Champion's Ballad. Oh, so this is where I'm supposed to be able to find a bunch of luminous stones. Well, that would be good, because then we could upgrade the Guardian Circlet, which would be really nice. Hmm. That's a good 5k goal. Because, like, 4k is good. 5k is also good. Because 5k, we can do something sillier. could start the other two Divine Beast quest lines. Or at least one of them. I don't know how much I want to speed through it, though. This game is very fun, and I kind of already feel like we're, we're power escalating at a rate that I, I sort of wish was going a little slower. Um, because for as much fun as this is, you know, it's... When you get to be a little bit overpowered, it's it's less fun to play. Whoops. Hmm. 5k fairy? Oh! Actually, yeah, okay, how about... 5k, we make an effort to, or we, we go and find the other two leviathan skeletons. Because um, one of them's way out in the Gerudo Desert, and one of them is uh, in the Hebro region, but it's hard to get to. Uh, actually, maybe that should be for, for something higher than a 5k. No, we can, okay, how about a 5k we go and do one of them? Uh, we could do the Gerudo one. It's, it's a little hard to get to just because traveling across the sand is kind of a pain in the butt without the right gear. Uh, but it doesn't have a side quest uh, and a hidden area associated with uh, finding it. So, And there's a great fairy there, although uh, I think it's going to be a while before we can afford to, uh, to unlock her. <laughs> In the meantime, there's a shrine up there. Let's do that. I would put a 
Talus fight if I were designing such a thing. But I suppose perhaps I'm just seeing things. Or maybe that's what it wants me to think. Fine, maybe it's normal and whatever. Where's that shrine I was going towards? Oh, oh, hold on. I'm sensing, dang it. Why do you guys have to friggin, yeah, I'm working on it. Whoop, okay, that was faster than I expected. Your bits. Dang it. Alright, great. Alright, sorry weary travelers. You, you doing- oh, are you the friggin' hearty truffle people again? Hello? God damn it! Please go literally anywhere else. Wait, is that a stable? Is that a stable we haven't found yet? Oh no, this is a stable we already know about. Okay, whatever. Where's that shrine I was going towards? <laughs> Alright. I think when night falls, we're gonna go back to looking for... Where's the magic shrine? Uh, luminous stones and... Uh, Zora monuments and stuff like that. Ah! You cannot hide your shrines from me! Oh, it might be where those birds are circling. That would make sense. trouble with the Death Mountain region is everything already kind of glows orange, so it's easy to miss the shrines. Uh, yes, that is a thing. Birds circling signals something interesting you haven't explored yet, often undiscovered shrines. Oh, I should get rid of the sword. And I'm gonna take off my headphones, because I don't need them if I'm not on a call, and they're uncomfy. Oh boy, a little stretch. Okay, let's go. Ah, now we got both of them. We got uh, Valmeno and Valruda. Oh no, tell me this isn't more golf. Oh, thank God. Yep, skip, skip. Okay, whatever. First things first. There we go. Uh... Okay, I see. Oh, we don't need to waste our good arrows. Awesome. Oh, ah, it went out. Oh well, it's fine. Whoop! <laughs> Alright, be a little less on fire, my dude. Awesome. What? What? Chests can burn? Huh. Alright, well, you learn something new every day, I guess. Uh, pfft. Okay, let's see. The, um... 
Yeah, so I think for, uh, did we do 4K or 5K to do the uh, Gerudo Leviathan Skeleton? Oh yes, 5k. Cool. Um, yeah. I think we're gonna stick around in the Zora region for a little while, just because we've stalwartly avoided it until now, and, you know, there's always this nice stuff. Oh yeah, and 4k was we, uh, actually, we're pretty close by, so 4k we, we find the guy for Terrytown, um, which is not Far from here, if I recall correctly. Although I think I've only found it once. I've only done the Terrytown quest once. Okay. Awesome. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Zorana. We want to go back up there. Let's see. Are those guys having a camp or beating somebody up? Ah, uh, they're just partying. We don't need to offend them. Although I like how they set up the fire choo-choos right next to the uh, explosive barrels just in case you want to kill them. Alright. Let's, um... Wait, what the heck do I have to set as my quest? Oh, yeah, the Hinox we have to kill. Um, mm, set that one at least so I can remember. Uh, let's see. Let's warp to... Man, I really should have said something there. Oh. This might work. <laughs> it's not too far. Oh, I need fireproof elixir to. Ah, it's it's kind of low down though. It's like the, it's at like the base of the mountain, I think. Um, where you can catch the lizards to make the elixirs, if I recall correctly. Just one bar. Oh wait, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. No. <laughs> uh Oh well. Well, that's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine, Link. You're freaking out, bro. Okay, all right. So maybe we're freezing a little bit. Where the hell is Upland Zorana? There it is. Oh, sweet. A shooting star fell. That never jerks us around. Oh, for frick's sake. Dude, fine. Fine. We'll put on the warmer pants. Are you happy? Sheesh. Yeah, now he's fine. anything too important. Oh, we can get the Lionel! We can get a picture of the Lionel. Perfect. Then we can get the full Zora set. I might have to re-up our stamina a little bit. Nah, we're fine. For now, at least. Whoops, my stamina. <laughs> oh, never change me. Dang it, that's such a waste of good healing. Ugh, why do I have to be so good at cooking? Okay, fine. Whatever. Is this cinematography enough? <laughs> what did I just say? Spooky. I'm sure my stamina is doing fine.
fine. Yeah, we're fine. Wow, I love Tears of the Kingdom. Did I just fall off the cliff? The blood moon rises once again. Not Zelda, not now, Zelda. I'm in a crisis. Yep. Yep. Dicks. Oh my god. Damn you, Ganon. <laughs> Truly your evil knows no bounds. All right, where are we warping to? <laughs> uh Let's do the Lionel. <laughs> wow. So good. True heroism has a face, and that face is mine. <laughs> I shouldn't have gotten so distracted by how pretty the moon looked. Well, whatever. Ah, oh, there she is, in all her glory. Okay. Oops. Why this mount? Ah! Oh! Might actually be able to get that star. I, I've been burned so many times before, but but it's right there, gloriously close, and yet so far away. All right, we might be able to make this work. About four in game hours before it disappears. I think maybe if we get up the waterfalls, go off the crag of point. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, miss. I'm, I'm in crisis right now. We might be aggroing the Lionel a little bit on the way, but that's okay. All right. Quick. Gotta put our. Gotta put our Zora tunic on. Why don't I sprint? I do sprint, and then when I'm about to run out of stamina, I stop sprinting. Because otherwise I'll run out of stamina! Oh, for fuck's sake. We are on a clock! Alright, great work, Prince Adam. We're, we're so proud of you. Alright, focus. We've got three in-game hours. We can do this. Oh, it's beautiful. Shining with potential. Come on, buddy. Come on. We can do this. Just this once, for me. Yes, yes. Oh, it's glorious. This one wasn't clipped into a wall or anything. Yes! Oh, thank God. Okay, great. All right, back to swimming up the waterfall. <laughs> Miss Mount. Picture the red Lionel. We get the pants. We take care of some of the other side quests, because it's fun to check off boxes. Then we hit 
5k. 5k. We venture out into the Gerudo Desert. With the aim of getting the uh, picture of the great Leviathan skeleton out there. And maybe picking up some of the equipment that makes it easier to navigate the Gerudo Desert because it is rough out there. That's how I nearly fell to my death last time. Maybe for 6k we get Link the Gerudo outfit. <laughs> It's always good to have. Sadly, it has no armor value. But you can't put a price on looking good. Hold on. Oop, just a sec. There we go. All right. All right, Lionel. Where are you at? I need you to smile for the camera, big man. There he is. Yeah. Maybe if we get to 4K right now, we, we aggro him and kill him again. Nice. Ooh. Hello. Which one is that? I think that's Farash. The lighting's weird, though. Aw, see? He's looking at it, too. Whoops. Hold on. <laughs> well, who can I... How can I say no to a free shot, Garrow? Ah, it might be Nadra. Yeah. Alrighty. Well, on our way down, let's see if we can spot any more, like, actually, yeah, while we're in Alonzo Mano, we can take a look around. Let's see, how many of those have we already seen? Uh, hmm, it doesn't tell me how many we've already found. Great. Oh, I think he does give us hints, though, if we need Oh shit, we hit for it. Damn it! Alright, I'll go back and fight the Lionel again. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, well, thanks for reminding me. Alright, let's just save real quick. Oh, we're at the Lenegro Great Spring. Huh. Weird. Oh, yeah, I guess we are. Wild. Oh, I see. It's not on Mount Lenegro. That makes more sense. Alright. We gotta put our, uh, our good pants on. Maybe our power outfit. Get out our good sword. And now... Adventure! To slay the fell beast! Alright, then we get the pants. <laughs> then we... Yeah. Just easy when I'm running, I guess. Um, Alright, then we get pants. Uh, resolve that quest line. Then we go get the Terrytown guy, because that was the original 4K goal, and I am a, I'm a streamer of my word. Alright, bud. Alright, pal. Alright, friend. Alright, amigo. <laughs> What's going on? Hello. I think I'm so far away that it wouldn't let me flurry rush. Yeah. Let me in. Oh, 
<laughs> Alright. Oh no. Oh no! Link! Oh thank god. Whoop. You know what? We're gonna eat some food. <laughs> Just a little. Just a skosh. Just uh And I guess we're gonna let the master sword break. Yep. And once again. Guess where I got this from. Whoops. Oh, 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 okay. Oh no! Oh god! <laughs> there we go. Sheesh! Because if he knocks me far enough away, he switches into using his ranged attacks, and they're devastating! Stop that! What? 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 What is happening? This is so interesting. fun. Oh, I think we can upgrade the barbarian stuff now. More again, because we, we, we killed another one. Alright, let's drop some stuff. Uh, this is by far the worst thing I have. Um, uh, let's get out of here. Oh, and this Lionel shield is better? How interesting. Well, that was interesting. I have no idea why it teleported. Uh, but I guess it worked out for us. All right, let's get the pants. Um, all right, awesome. So I guess Lionel's teleport if they get stuck on the geometry? Huh. Actually, that makes sense. The horses in this game are a little bit finicky about where they can and can't travel. And the bottom half of the Lionel is a horse, so I guess it makes sense you could get stuck on the geometry and just <laughs> blorp out of there. <clears throat> My apologies. <laughs> oh, that's cute. How terrifying. I should have gotten an action shot. Pants! Yeah! That's sad. 
and they happen to fit me perfectly, which must mean he was also trying to marry me. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, we got the full set. We can see uh, what the great fairies need to upgrade and how much they can upgrade. Might take a detour there after we do the uh, fairy town thing. Do you have a quest or are you just chilling? It's just chilling, all right, whatever. Okay, back to Upland Zorana. Maybe this time we can actually find some luminous stones without getting distracted. Maybe that chance, but we can we can always dream. And then we'll get the uh, Terrytown boy on the way, and we can go to Terrytown and check him out because we're actually not that far. Hey, hey, what the? Oh, I'm wearing the wrong shirt. That makes sense. Sorry. <laughs> How silly of me. Now let me out. Thank you. Confused because you know all these sleeved shirts look alike to me. Nice. Rivali's Gale is now ready. <laughs> Thanks, bud. Good to know. also in the direction of Death Mountain, which is where we need to go for this thing. Ooh. Take whatever those things are. Aw, oh, sick. Party radishes. Next time we're in the vicinity of a stable, we can cook. domain is so pretty. But when you read the lore about how luminous stones maybe contain the soul of the dead, it becomes a little unsettling that they use them as building materials. Well, when we do the great fairy stuff, we can see what they need to upgrade the, uh, the guardian armor, because... If we can get that basically as bulked up as possible, it would be nice to have uh, just really, really tough armor as an option. And we might be able to justify going to the Forgotten Temple and killing all the Guardians again. <laughs> you know, life's simple joys. Hoping for luminous stuff, but they'll do. Nice. Nice. All right. I believe that is another one of those. Ooh, hold on. Now that's definitely. failed successfully. Oh no. There they go. Oh, see, they stopped. All right, we'll get this one and then we'll go find those and we'll be fine. Signed. 
Oh, buddy. We've all been there. Alright, give me my rocks. Yeah. How many did that guy want? Ten? Oh, three more to go. Damn it. I keep going down from the high places I need to be. Oh, but we can always just swim up here, right? Nice little reservoir. I have no idea what that siren outside is doing. That's not how they normally sound. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's like there's somebody record scratching on it, like a DJ. Alright, let me up. Let me up. God, this waterfall's big. Heck yeah. Oh, glorious. Exactly as planned. Just according to Kikaku. Oh, sick. More Luna Stones. Hell yeah. And... Oh, yeah! Awesome. <clears throat> and we'll make our way over towards Death Mountain. See if we can get to the guy we need for Terrytown. And then for 5k, we venture into the Gerudo Desert. <laughs> nice. You know, maybe have a nice little vacation. Yeah, just a lot of nice things. There he goes. Rest in pieces. Alright. Any more rocks? No rocks. Okay, that's okay. We don't need rocks. Where we're we going? We don't need rocks. Okay. <laughs> I believe the guy we're looking for is on the road up the volcano. But I'm not positive I know where that is. I think it's, uh... Might be here? No, I think that's Goron City, actually. Might be... Well, I think it's definitely along this road, at least. So, by the tower would be good. Which means, really, we could just warp there, but, you know, it's, it's about the journey, not the destination. We'll just head for the tower and go from there. I believe the Elden Skeleton is the one we already have a picture of. Which is good. Uh, the Hebrew one's hard to find. And the Gerudo one is just way out in the corner of the map. But it's going to be fun. Always cool to go there. Oh, we can check out the hot springs while we're on our way. So yeah, let's just take the, you know, walking route that you're supposed to. Oh, nice. <laughs> There's, um, some people have data mined stuff out of Breath of the Wild, like, concepts that they were maybe considering using, you know, things that aren't in the final game, but are- Oh, you know what? Wasn't there that person that wanted the ice rod? Who was that? I know I have a side quest for it. Well... Two birds, one stone. Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> this is... Oh, I really gotta watch my stamina. Uh, what to drop? Probably that. Sorry. Alright, now who wanted one of these? Where's my adventure log? Was it... Yeah, it was one of the Koroks. Go back and do that. Alright, we gotta focus though. Theoretically. We're heading up to Elden. Or we could cook. Could always cook. Oh, we should see if the Congo's around here. While we're in the area. Alright, let's do a little cooking. 
Just a, just a little. Just a little cooking. Um... Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, right, and also now that we're out of the swimming zone, we gotta once more release the guns. There we go. All right, back to cooking. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. I gotta kill more animals. <laughs> oh, no. Take that out of context. Oh, whatever. Let's just do that. So much work cooking things that I don't need to be making this complicated. Take it. Okay, whatever. Oh, hello. Who are you? Oh. Bold Dawn. Oh, so close. Mm -hmm. ah, go on, Hot Springs. Just see the soul. Try and hunt for yourself. Turn south when you hit Goron City. Sure thing, Golden. Lusa. You got like a shrine quest? Or. Oh. How are you holding up? Oh, you know. Pretty good. There are many theories about its origin. Oh! <laughs> I don't need to hear a Pona song again now. I'm sorry. Oh, he looks so sad. But that's so cool that it's canonically a Pona's song. Congo, you paintbrush headed bitch, where are you? Nowhere. Okay. Guess there's no memory in this location. I'm sorry, who are you? I wish I had this kind of artistic skill. Whoa! Ooh. Lazunda, the owner of this stable. Really? That volcano in the background, it's so majestic. And the stable is subtle in the scenery. Uh, I think the stable was painted from a southern direction. Huh. Oh. That's kind of cool. Mm? Wait, I've already been here? Oops. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, good work, team. Anyway, back to it. All right. Today's goal is to... Oop. Ah, okay. Never mind. Today's goal is to not get set on fire. All right. We also got to be on the lookout for lizards. Like that one. Yeah. could hang out in the hot springs to make up for the massive damage that we took fighting that Lionel. What does this say? Oh, cool. Death Mountain marker number one. No, oh, come back. Damn it. How are these lizards so fast? Aha! Oh, it's gone. Okay. What else? Oh, boy. Excuse me. Ah, oh, boy. cannot hope to defeat me. I will constantly regenerate while in the water. Oh. This is soothing my soul, just to think about. Although, Link, you gotta be careful. Don't let your hair go too far into water. You're gonna have trouble combing it for, like, three days. Aha, you fools! Here is where I am strongest! Ooh, give me this. 
Nice. Oh, heck yeah. Man, well, that was awesome. Oh! There he is. There he is. Being all lizardy and weird. Oh, excuse me, sir. <laughs> Ugh. Why do you guys take more than one hit? Where did I go? Jeez. God, you guys are annoying. Ooh, luminous stones. That'll be pretty good, maybe. Mmm. Nah, we're fine. Hello. Cairo. Is it normal for magma bombs to not rain down nonstop? I just don't understand the weather around here. Oh. Yeah, what do you got? Ooh. I have no money. My apologies. But what will you buy? Hmm. Oh, you can always get rid of some amber. Won't need that for a while. Good to me. All right. Laters. All right, get over here, baby lizard. Get over here. No! He escaped. Curses. Whoops. Whoop. All right, slightly on fire. We're good. Guys, whoops, hold on. Change to the less important arrows. Really taking advantage of how many arrows I have. Did the Lionel's gear upgrade because we already killed him once? Because if so, I like that mechanic. You know, I guess it makes sense we wouldn't really be able to search this one for parts, considering it appears to have been buried in a lava flow. Oh. Oh, God. God, that's intimidating. Look at it. Is it moving, or... Does it, does it still have its legs? Oh, it does. Oh, even worse. Is it on the road? All right, well, forget that. We're going up and around, baby. Unless we get to 5k right now, in which case I'll go fight it. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah! Why are you like this? Thanks. Oh, hold on. Am I in an area? No, okay, it's just the fire keys. Okay. Yeah, it's not worth it. What, Link, come on, man. <laughs> Please just climb the cliff instead of moonwalking by it. Hmm. Yep, don't like that. I see you, bitch. Alright. Up and around. so pretty at night. <laughs> Could do without the populace, though. <laughs> Alright, up we go. Okay, yeah, I think we should be okay. Whoop! Spoke too soon. Link, Link, buddy. Whoa! Oh god! Thanks, Mifa. What was that I said about fighting it? Oh, hold on. Alright, here's what we're gonna try. And you guys didn't even need to get me to 5k. Oh, 
Okay, that was fun. Nice. All right, where'd that Goron go, guy? <laughs> where'd that Goron guy go? Hey, man, you good? Yeah, he's fine. I wonder if he'll give me something for saving him. Nope. Okay, cool. Yeah, I guess that wasn't really worth commenting on. Moving on. The Master Sword is 60 because it glows and doubles in power in the presence of Malice, and all the Guardians have been reanimated by Ganon's Malice. So, basically it gives you extra damage against things like Blights and uh, Guardians, and but not against regular enemies. So they sort of encourage you to be selective with when you use it. For instance, these chuckleheads don't deserve the Master Sword. Well, let's just do this one. Sir. There we go. All right, awesome. Nice. Ah, if only we hadn't, if only we hadn't proc Mipha's grace, we could be using these hot springs to regenerate health for free. Guys, seriously. Now, considering Varuda is not very far from Death Mountain, the uh, difficulty curve from going from one to the other is a bit intense. And I like it! I've been complaining about how things have been too easy, so this is great. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Come on, then! Fight me! I will show you the true meaning of fear. Ha! Whoops, hold on. <laughs> time out, time out, time out. Uh, yeah. Oh, I should put Mephist Trident in my house. Come on, then. Squeak! There we go. Whoop, nope, that's not what I want. I knew there was a quick bar thing. I just kept forgetting what it was. But now we're good. So now we can go back and get that diamond whenever we want. I guess, spoiler alert, the guy gives you a diamond for every 10 luminous stones, which is not a good trade financially. Luminous stones sell for 70 each, and diamonds are 500 each, which means, you know, trading in 10 of them just for, them, just for the cash is an extra 200 rupees. But you can use diamonds to upgrade the diamond circlet, which is very useful, so it's a good trade specifically for that. think I've ever gone through this underground area before. I hope we have more things like this in Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, I'm starting to see why I've never gone through this underground area before. No thank you, sir. Ooh, hello, extremely bombable rock. We'll take that. Fellas, I... Look, I understand. I get it. I'm on a clock. I'm busy. Alright, now where was I? What? Wow! Come on, really? Oh, that was so cruel. I wonder if this is where they were excavating guardians. All right, are we still are we still having issues? Okay, yeah. Sheesh. Whoop, that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> well, it's fine. I'm sure I won't forget where that is and then blow myself up later. Ooh. Ha! Improvise. Adapt. Overcome. 
Yeah, I think maybe they were excavating guardians here. Or, well, I guess maybe they just got buried in a lot below. Alright, I'm getting out of here before the choo-choo's really catch up to me. Right, they were excavating the guardians in the Gerudo region. Which makes sense, you know, big flat desert. And ties in with my theory that the reason why Calamity Ganon, uh... Well, the, the reason why there aren't really any active Guardians in the Gerudo region is because Calamity Ganon is still on the inside Ganondorf, who remembers being a mortal Gerudo man and is nostalgic for his old home. Uh, because if they were excavated there, I feel like it would be ground zero on getting absolutely demolished by these things when they all went, you know, Terminator mode. Aha! Oh, yes. Stealth. Tactics. Precision. What, what are we... What does it say? There we go. Nice. <laughs> Aww. I love that the, the way the world is designed. It's just like... Yeah, you know. People travel around. Wait, hold on. I'm not on the road. What am I doing? Uh, pe people travel from point A to point B, but the, the, the people of Hyrule are very different. And sometimes you just gotta warn the little non-fireproof guys that uh, it's gonna be bad. Ah. Hmm. I'm sensing some peril. Alright, I think we're still okay. I think we'll know when we're not. Oh, yep. Yep. <laughs> Found it. All right, let's see. What do we need then? I think I think we need to make a fireproof elixir and then come back. <sighs> well, yeah, that's okay. We can just warp back to Elden Tower. We we've we've taken the slow path. Now I feel okay doing the warp. Back to the cooking pot. Wherever it is. Wait, is this the shrine? No, hold on. Ah, okay. Oh, you know, they might have been talking about the shrine that's down there, actually. Maybe. Alright. Okay. Okay. One fireproof elixir coming right up. Let's just, uh... We don't tend to experiment with these. I wonder if that'll make it last longer. It'll be more powerful or something. <laughs> nice! Okay. We're gonna warp to the tower, we're gonna down that elixir, and then we're gonna go. Oh yeah, I probably could've also talked to the lady at the stable who might've given us some, but that's okay, we're fine. We want, there, there is a mine where you can get some armor. We're going to be going to that mine, but we want to not catch fire on the way. So that's where we're going to go. All right, now we got to hoof it. Let's see, that's the road. And there's a shrine, that's good. <laughs> oh, hold on, we gotta make sure none of our gear burns. Um, okay. Okay, we're good. For fuck's sake, hold on. No! Hold 
on. Yeah, we ain't dealing with that today. <laughs> Unless we get to 5k right now, in which case I'll go fight it. Whoa, easy, Link. Easy. This is the road to it. I mean, I'm sure you guys will let me know if I'm doing something hilariously wrong. I think we're in the right place. I think we will be in a second. Yeah, I know taluses aren't that bad. We haven't... We've only done regular taluses and a couple of the weird ones, like the one in the crater. Ooh, which are all back now. We want to go kill some of them again for more cash. Um, but anyway, the igneo talus is hurt to touch, and I don't have the flame breaker armor yet. So, you know. If we can avoid that, that would be nice. Okay, okay, I think we're in the right place. Still, yeah. Okay, awesome. Noise. Aha! You there, sir. Uh. Hey, you showed up just the right time. I'm on my way back from Gorn City. We forgot to buy souvenirs. Captured some of those fireproof losers, but those suckers are quick. I bet you can catch a ton. Bring me ten. I'll even give you some heat-resistant armor. Leave it to me, buddy. Ooh. Just ten. Okay. How many do we have already? Eight. Awesome. Okay, two more. Let's go pick up some rocks. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. All right, give me that armor. Ah. Yeah. Have a big bouquet of lizards. Here you go. Thanks, buddy. Yeah! Hmm? Something the matter, buddy? My helmet? Sorry, I didn't for lending. Too expensive for that. You can buy your own in Goron City. Yep. Oh, nice. Cool. Alright. Great! Well, now we're not gonna catch fire. Sadly, we have to put the guns away, but... Such is the price of not catching on fire. All right. Hello, sir. Boren. Wrong last name. Okay, never mind. Wait. Tiny, adorable Goron. You must talk. <gasps> There's a son. And you are? Palasun. Name ends in son. Yup. Are you strong? You bet I'm strong. And my big bro, Grayson, is even stronger. <gasps> From the Flying Graysons? Where is he? Show me this Grayson. You there. What is your name? Django. Oh, sorry. Who are you? Me? I'm Django. Not Grayson. <laughs> You're useless to me. If you want to talk, come see me when it's night time. Hello? Yeah. Grayson! What's your name? The name's Grayson. What's it to you? Name ends in son. What about it? It's time to work now. If you want to talk, come back at night when I'm relaxing. Okay. Guess we got a little time to kill. It's a good thing we got. It's a good thing we got that fireproof armor, so that we're not gonna wait out our elixir. Let's just take some rocks and uh, then sit by that fire. Oh, also nice of them to have this, so we can cook a fireproof elixir if need be. Hello, sir. Django. Grayson! Yeah. What is it? Wait, bro, we already talked. I'm digging to dig, day in and day out. To be honest, I'm sick of it. I feel like maybe I'm not meant to toil away in obscurity like this. Uh, I want to be where the people are. I want to see. I want to see them dancing. There is? 
Where? Please tell me more. Terrytown. <laughs> None of your business. Terrytown? What's the deal with that place? Well, you see. Hmm. Akala. Terrytown. There is somewhere out there that needs me. A call to adventure, you could say. It's not too far from here. All right, I'm going to do it. Yeah! Oh. Thanks for letting me know, brother. Pelson and I are going to head there right away. While I'm at it. Oh. Pelson! We're going to leave! Huh? Well, that was quick. Great, that was fun. All right. Oh yeah, we gotta check in with them now. I'd say that's part of the 4K reward, so yeah, we'll go there right now. And we can stop being on fire. Or nearly on fire. And we can check in with the Great Fairy first, see what she can upgrade and what we need to upgrade things more. Alright, and while we're doing that, I'm gonna take a quickie sandwich break. North. Okay. Alright, quick. It's an emergency. There we go. Hello, Great Fairy. Ooh, more luminous stones. Well, alright. Uh, on the way to the Great Fairy, we get more luminous stones. God, can you believe I was having trouble thinking of stuff to do in this game earlier? Laughable. Wow. Well, a little too laugh like, but really. Nice. Oh, we're gonna get so many diamonds. Oh, spooky. Hello. Hello, great fairy. Hello. Are there any smaller fairies? Nope. Just the big one. Hello! Whoops. Overshot. There we go. Hello! Let me see your clothes. Oh. Nice! Enhance away! Okay! Ooh, we can get the Zora armor enhanced. That's good. Ooh, that's very good. What do we need for the Guardian armor? Ah, more ancient gears. Alright, specifically we need 12 more ancient gears. Well, that sounds very manageable. For this one, I need... Ah, okay. Gotcha. And we need to kill some more Lynels. <laughs> we gotta get the murder pants up and running. And then for 5k, we venture into the Gerudo region. To get the, uh... Mm -hmm. Great skills. Don't, don't tell me about set bonuses! <laughs> no! Yes. Huh. Alright, we're just gonna skip through this. Yep, thanks. Yep, yep. Oh. Great. Yes. Alright, what does it take to enhance the Zora's helm a second time? Ah, we just need a lot of fish. Yeah, we can do that. And there we go. Oh. oh, wait, hold on. Okay, yeah, we need three more diamonds to enhance the diamond circlet, which would be great. So we're gonna, we're gonna, Ooh. we're gonna try and do that. And then for, f yeah, so 5k, we're gonna venture out into the, like, bottom left corner of the map, the Gerudo Desert, get the picture of the Leviathan Skeleton. At least, uh, make contact with the Great Fairy out there. We won't be able to wake her up yet, because we don't have 10,000 fucking rupees. Um, but we can get the shrine out there, so we can go back whenever we want. Which is gonna be nice. Um, whoops, easy, easy. 
Whoa there. Alright. And... Huh. I wonder what that is. Oh, you know what? I think it's the stable out there. That makes sense. Ooh. Hot Terry Town's already looking pretty nice. Hey, send some Gorons back here. They're perfect. The brute strength of Goron is undeniable. These boulders don't stand a chance against them, and with names like Grayson and Pellison, they'll fit right in. I love this dumbass found family. Oh, we started selling ore. That's nice. Well, next is, uh-huh. We need homes. Can you bring me 20 bundles of wood? I can combine it with what I've already got and get started on new houses. Oh, boy. All right, how much wood do we already have? Uh, uh, four. Okay, we need 16 more bundles of wood. And you know, the nearest big field full of wood happens to have some guardians in it. And we do need more gears. So, you know what they say. <laughs> when in doubt, murder! Hello, sir. All right. Thank you for Whoops. Scat. All right, anyway, where was I? Oh yes, that's right, bombs. <laughs> wow. He went out like a light. Arm. I want the boomerang. Thank you. Okay, anyway. Yeah, okay. Oh boy, there he is. We should probably get rid of those guys first. Just to make things a little bit easier. Yeah, here we go. Oh god. I think I need you to run in the direction I want you to run. Thank you. One, yes. <laughs> like I'm juggling them. Woo! Felt that one. Excuse me. Come on, buddy. Get closer. What? I gotta remember to use my patented sword beam. <laughs> More legs. No legs for you. Hey, not landing. There we go. Awesome. Bits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, get real close. You know you want to. Oh, I'm right over here. All vulnerable and stuff. You can definitely get closer. I'm just a normal hero. Come closer. Ha ha! Spare you from my wrath. Well, oh, easy, buddy. Nice. All right, where'd all the bits go? Cool. Yeah. All right, how much do we have now? 
pretty close. Not bad. Anything else? Yeah, just a little bit. Great. Okay, why did we come here? Wood! That's right. Okay. Let's see. Just to be sure, we got any more decayed guardians around here? Looks like we're okay. All right, back to business. How many of these do I need again? Ah, yes, 20. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I think we can get the, uh, the next person objective for Terrytown uh, for the 5k reward because, you know, getting the wood bundles is just time consuming. Uh, finding the people is actually interesting. Ooh, heck yeah. And then we can always go back to the Forgotten Temple and, you know, clear it out again. Maybe do a little bit of archaeology. Just really explore it when we're not getting constantly shot in the face with lasers. Whoop. Easy. Whoa there. feeling. The funny feeling is called when they bait you with herbs. They may, might be trying to mess with you. But I think we're fine. What could possibly go wrong? You hear that big man? Alright, awesome. One more. Ooh, and this one has apples on it. Even better. Nice. Put those now and then. Cool. Great. Okay, back to Terrytown. Which we'll just warp to. Make things easier on ourselves. So, I brought him. Sure. Mm. Next is, could you look for someone who's got a gift for tailoring? Mm. We're talking about tailoring. There could be someone among the Gerudo who's good at that. 
Good luck, you'll need it. This seems like a real long shot. Oh, and one last wrinkle. Yeah, in accordance with the official Bolson construction policy, that someone's name must end in sun. Sure. Awesome. Okay. Well, let's, let's talk with Grace and see how he's doing. Hey, buddy. Hey, uh. It's you. As you can see, I'm working real hard. That's what praise me. A ton for breaking these rocks. We're finding some nice ore, too. Well, I'm glad they're doing all right. <laughs> Thriving. Crops flourishing. Skin clear. All right. Let's see. Where to go? When we hit 5k, we're going to aim for the uh, Great Leviathan Skeleton. Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> we can go back to Hateno, upgrade our house a little bit more, and deposit Mipha's Trident so I don't keep stressing about breaking it. Uh, and then, when we hit 5k, we can head to the Gerudo region and start doing stuff for that. We can uh, look for that person that Hudson is looking for, and we can maybe acquire the Gerudo outfit. I think that was the 6K idea, Gerudo outfit. Um, so we'd like go out and then back to get the Leviathan skeleton. And we could go on another talus hunt if we wanted. Oh, and we need to give the, the Luminous Stones to that one guy in Zora's Domain. Alright, so we're going to do this first and then that. And then uh, the other stuff, maybe. Oh, I'm loving the Bolson School of Tiny Home Construction. It's very cute. Hello. Hi. Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> Alright, get out of here, you. <laughs> Sorry, this is a place of honor now. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Anyway. Bolson, take my money. Make my house better. Thank you. Uh, Morning. Build me something. What you want? Uh, pfft, what other installations do we need to clear out? Yeah, lighting. Um, lighting would be nice. Yeah, I can chill that out. Hope you do. Looks like a house now. Uh. Alrighty. What else can we do? Oh. Hi. I've got a little more spending cash. Uh, yeah, let's do some house exterior stuff. Sure, oh. a sign with my name. Why not? Yeah, we'll just take care of all the house exterior stuff. Then it's just adding more gear displays. And then eventually the house will be finished. Oh. Yep. <laughs> Great. Thanks, fellas. Mm. All right. Just a couple more things. Mm. Uh, when I initially did this, I didn't understand <laughs> that you couldn't just okay. be like, Hey, could you get me like a like a dining table or like paint the interior so it doesn't suck? Oh. Um you have to just literally get everything and then Bolson is like, oh by the way, you know, I cleaned it up a little bit, added some nice stuff, photos, you know, whatever. So that's nice. All 
Alright, let's go frolic through the flowers just a little bit and get the last house exterior thing done. Wow, so beautiful. So whimsical. So, uh, oops, hold on. It's time to honor my forefathers. Yeah! Yeah. No worries, though. Okay. Nice flowers, Bolson. Not sword proof, but that's okay. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, back. Uh, yes. Nice exterior. Plant trees. Oh. Yeah. I'm ready to pay up. Alright, yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Ah! <laughs> House progress. Let's go back to Zora's domain real quick uh, to do the diamond thing. Oh, we could also do some of the EX armor stuff if we wanted to, but. Oh, and the freezing rod. Oh, dang it. Everything's happening. Yeah, I think maybe until we hit 5k, I'll just check some. Oh, wait, we hit 5k. Sorry. Whoops. Okay. Um. Well, thanks to Dragon Jedi Zero for donating exactly four hundred and twenty-three dollars. Um, all right, we're gonna do this real quick, and then we're gonna go to Gerudo area. We're gonna see about getting that that cool Leviathan skeleton, and then six uh, K, we get the Gerudo outfit. Um, Oh, hello, Prince Sidon. How you doing? Shucks, thanks. All right. Great. Yep. Okay. Awesome. Thanks. Love you too, bud. Okay, let's go. Mm. Sir. Hello. Mm. <clears throat> oh. You're really giving me ten luminous stones. In that case, please excuse me while I count them. Oh. And a one. Oh. And a two. Mm. And a three. Oh. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten! Oh my, you really brought all ten. Thank you. Yes, I will happily take those luminous stones from you. I've aged a hundred years, my man. Yeah! <laughs> what? Yeah! Hmm. <laughs> Well, hey, one more of those, and uh, we'll be able to upgrade the diamond circlet. Oh, we only need one more luminous stone! Ooh, the pain. All right, we'll do that later. For now, we're off to the Gerudo Desert. Let's see. I think... Hold on, let's get rid of this. And let's pin our destination. And then let's fast travel here. Link is definitely not 17. Zelda is 17. Also, they're both 100 and whatever now, so. Okay. Oh. Oh, you know what I forgot about? <laughs> um. That little detail in the way. Hmm. Oh, 
we might be making a little Terry Town progress here later than we know. No, come on, nothing ventured. Nothing gained. I think we can make our way around it. Maybe. Well, let's see. We can at least go to the little outposty thing. be a little bit tricky to get around. Well. Uh-oh. Hmm. I'm sensing some issues with this plan. Pfft, that's okay. We'll just stay in the shade. Or we'll just eat a whole bunch of food and be fine. Ah, uh, for crying out loud, you whiner. All right, what do we have, clothing-wise? Anything? Hmm. Oh, it doesn't work. That would just make too much sense. We got any elixirs for this? Hmm, no, we have elixirs for the opposite of that. It's fine. We'll just cheese it. We'll head for the oasis and go from there. Oh, ice rod. Smart move, guys. Love to see it. Yeah! Oh, so fresh, so so cool. Uh, Alright, that'll be fine. Mipha's grace is ready. Thanks, Mipha. Oh. Whoops. God. Scariest divine beast. <laughs> Great, terrifying. Oh, you know what? Where is it? It's right here somewhere. There it is. All right, sandwich break. So that's the that's the only Yiga that canonically dies cuz all the others teleport away. We read about this in Zelda's diary. And that is why you don't yell at your bodyguard to leave you alone. <laughs> All right, 
Good work, team. Hello. The scary robot humpy cavil thing. Oh. <laughs> Preparation is my middle name. You know, we might need to get the Gerudo outfit even before 6K just so we don't, you know, Bossak! die. Cool. bud great incredible I don't even know if this is one of the dogs that leads you somewhere cool I'm just really happy all right well while he's having that fun let's talk to this person real quick. Dava. hello person whose whose name ends in Sun who are you uh, eh? I am I bet Mama would have a problem with a delicate bow like you. <laughs> Sorry, Link, you're too much of a twink. Search. Quite a rush. Huh. A gifted tailor. Go to Terrytown. You hear the details. Well, you see... <laughs> Great. All right, have fun. Okay. Where'd that dog go? Hey, best buddy. You, you going somewhere or just hanging out? Nah, he's just hanging out. But he's just the cutest little guy. Okay. Well, we did that. Ooh, there's other people here. <gasps> Is that my boy Beetle? Hello, Beetle! Beetle, my beloved! Yeah! Yeah! He might kill me, but not until I close the deal. What have you got? You know, I'm actually good on arrows right now, I think. But you can never have too many. Wait. Hold on. Sorry. There we go. That makes more sense. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> nope. I have no rubies. Oh no, the Garudoff. It probably costs rupees, doesn't it? Well, that'll be a consideration for later. I guess we can sell some more stuff. Bah! Who has the time? We're going on a grand epic adventure! We're making it to the Great Leviathan Skeleton out there, and we definitely aren't gonna get struck by lightning on the way! I see no downsides to this incredibly awesome plan. <laughs> oh, that fills me with so much existential dread. I love it. Oh, buddy. Let's get a closer look at that thing. Whoop. 
Whoops. Whoops! Oh no! Oh, dang it. This is gonna hurt. Whiner. All right, quick. Equip the weapon I can't use again. All right, awesome. Might be a good idea to get the Gerudo Town Shrine, too. Just to have. Oh, you know what we could do? Yeah! There we go. Now we don't need to walk most of the way. Oh, we also have the ice spear. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, okay, cool. It's all coming together. No. What? Are you spying? It's research! Research! Pick what you want, but I finally found some key info on how to sneak into Gerudo Town. What info? Oh. <laughs> well, let me share with you my heroic tale. It's been close to a week now. The guards have kicked me out more times than I can count. Mm. I almost gave up hope. However, I've learned only recently of a man that slipped into this well-guarded town. That man is frequently traveling between Karakarbazar and Gerudo Town. I've been waiting here, trying to spot him as he travels. Uh huh. Okay, cool. Well, anyway. This whole thing smacks of gender. Yep, okay, all right. <sighs> it's the Zappy Lightning tutorial. Getting there. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Really? No? Okay. This way? Can I just cheese this with lightning weapons? Probably not. Ah, oh, do I not have enough just regular metal stuff? I might not. Hmm, normally I cheese this by dropping metal weapons. I wonder if I 
can cheese this, actually. Whoa! Really? Aww, oh, but it's only temporary. That's a shame. Well, that's cool to know, anyway. Alright, let's go to the other side first, maybe. sword, maybe. Gimme, give gimme. Give Alright, and now we need to get this one open. Okay. And we don't need... Come on. Yeah. Yeah. shift everything over there to well, let me pick it up even though it's zappy it will that's nice Come on, man. That wasn't before. I gotta do that with that, bro. Cool. Nice. Second box. Uh, are we... Are we done? No, there's another one. Dang it! Ugh. Okay, let's see. Uh, hmm. Oh, you know what? I guess we can use all these now. We are this I like this shrine. This is like a level of complexity that actually kind of feels like you're earning something with it. You know, for all my complaining. I genuinely do like this shrine. Nice. Alright. Let me get my sword back. 
Boink. Okay. Perfect. Hello. Nice. Okay. Well, we still can't go into Gerudo Town, but that's okay. Now we can warp back to here whenever we need to. You know, I'm sure this was not the intention, because, to be honest, th that much thought probably didn't go into something uh, as gendery as this specific side quest of the game is. But um, the fact that you can stand right in front of the guards and change into the Gerudo Vi outfit, and they'll be like, Oh, my mistake, miss, and let you in, makes me feel like they care significantly more about gender presentation as, like, only, you know, <laughs> only people who are currently self-identifying as women are allowed in Gerudo Town than they do care about, like, you know, any weird turfy shit. <laughs> I'm just saying. Like, it's, that seems to be an unintentional quirk of the game design, but it is what happens, so, you know. <laughs> Now we're cold. Of course we are. God, you are so needy. Okay, we're good. Let's see, how far do we have to go? Oh, you know, a little ways. So, so this big skeleton is not the big skeleton. We want an even bigger skeleton. Oh yeah, let me also save. <laughs> Just in case I do get struck by lightning. Crying out loud, guys! God, you are so annoying! Whoops, hold on. <laughs> Sorry, you don't deserve this weapon. that down. Jeez. Uh, I think maybe we're gonna go around these guys. Oh, so annoying. that like yeah that's a big skeleton that's a real big skeleton i wouldn't want to fight whatever had that as its skeleton but there's a bigger skeleton <laughs> all right where's vanaboras somewhere in there a little close for comfort but god you people Okay. All right. Did it try to do the tongue thingy? Bro, you don't have flesh anymore. Okay. Excuse me. Later, fuckos. All right, where was I? Peaceful, so serene. Absolutely no guardians anywhere. Soon. Whoops. Uh oh. Okay. 
bro, bro, bro. Ah, <laughs> okay, hold on. Sheesh. Okay. Nice. Anyway, where was I? This way, we can just warp back instead of having to run all the way. Sandstorm. So now our map doesn't work. That's okay, we're not going to deal with these guys either. No thanks, fellas. I said I'd get you guys to the Great Leviathan Skeleton, and by God, it's gonna happen. are so annoying! Alright. Whew. Oh. Is that it? Hold on. One way to find out. Yeah! Oh, we got it. Maybe we should get a better picture, though. Actually, I think this is the coolest possible picture we could take. No, that's not true. New one highlighted by the rising sun. There it is. There she is. Oh, look at that. Nightmare. Oh, so spooky. So s say hi to the wind shit fish, everybody. And it's dumb little chicken wings on its back. Oh, boy. What the hell is that? Did you scare a seagull or something? Oh, there it goes. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Nice. We got, uh, fine. Hmm. Oh, no, wrong one. Okay, what do we got? Oh, okay, I see.
Let me back up. Come on, man. Yeah, okay. 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 So if I recall correctly. Yep. <laughs> These things all make things complicated. That's okay. So what happens if we... <laughs> oh, no! My thingy! Oh, it's fine. We got it. Sir. Sir, do you mind? Shoot. Shoot. Well, cool, that was fun. All right, back to business. Well, let's get this in there and then, uh... Oh, right, okay, hold on. There's like a, there's like a couple, there's like a thing. There's actually multiple things. Uh, one of them was the... Chest. Yep. Nice. Okay. Let's get those bits. And let's find, I guess, an extra gear for that thing. Or, yeah, because we can't do that. Switch up there. Okay. Oh, I see. Uh huh. Wait, hold on. Is this completely unrelated? Oh, nice! Okay, cool. <laughs> I really thought that was going to be where they were hiding the gear. I seem to have been incorrect. Hmm. Where, then? Oh, wait. Is it literally just to the left? Sorry for giving you too much credit, Shrine. <laughs> okay. Okay. Actually, I like this more. Alright, what are we doing? Gotcha. Okay. Okay, I see what's happening. Drat. Ugh. Oh, everything's going to shit forever. Oh, maybe it only needs to be open for a little while. Nope, that would be too easy. Right, what am I forgetting? Come on, 
is that gonna be? Shit. Ah, oh, so close and yet incorrect. Hmm. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. God damn it. <laughs> What's the point anymore? Oh, wait. Yeah, okay. <sighs> All right, I got it. Wait, no. Okay, we're good. Now we're good. Thank you. What was that I was saying about how I liked this shrine? <laughs> All right, let me in. Give me whatever this is. Thank you. Okay. Anyway, back to business. That was very generous of them. Nice. Okay. Whew. All right. Okay, back to business. So, we have officially acquired the um, uh, picture of the Gerudo Great Leviathan. That's two out of three, I believe. I think we have the Elden one. Um, so only the Heber one is left. Uh, and the idea is for 6K, I think I said we'd grab the Gerudo outfit just because, you know, it's on our way. We're already kind of in the area. Um, we definitely don't have anywhere near enough rupees to get this great fairy fountain yet. But we have this shrine now, so we can come back whenever we need to. Hmm. We could do the Mulduga, although since we can't get into um, Gerudo Town yet, there's very little point. I mean, it'll help us out later, but... Yeah. Sweet boy. Please listen to my story. Yeah. Great Fairy Terra, this one's beautiful spring. Gosh, I wonder why people don't come all the way out here to this beautiful, boiling hot desert. Yeah. 10,000 rupees! Surely you jest, madam. Yeah. Look, I'll come back when I have a down payment on a fucking house, but Let's see if we can sand seal back. Oh no. Let's not do that actually. Let's um Well, let's get rid of this pin for one thing, because we've already done what we wanted to. Let's see. We can go back to Gerudo Town. We can go back to the stable and then go to Karakara Bazaar from there. <laughs> well, I would also like to not boil to death. Oh, right, let me just equip a different weapon so Link stops whining. There we go. Now let's see if we can get the sand seal. Maybe we can come back that way. And can't hurt to get these things in the meantime. Nope. Nope! Come on, man! Ugh, whatever. All right, let's see. Hey, let's see how close we can get to Naboris before she gets testy and hits us with lightning. Oh, sweet. Yeah, I'll take that. Wow. 
Is my cold equipment literally not enough? <laughs> well, let's try the regular pants. Nope, that doesn't help at all. Woof. Hmm. We can't always warp back if we need to. Oh, I see. It's the direct desert sunlight that's causing the problem. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, where are you, Vana Boris? Ah. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. All right. I'm not going to keep Link boiling. We're going to get out of here. Uh, a few things we can do. Oh, yeah. Let's go... Let's bounce back to Zora's domain and get just a... F like, one more um, Luminous Stone. Because then we can get one more diamond, and then we can upgrade the Guardian Circlet. And then maybe we'll do the Forgotten Temple again and get a lot more gears so we can also upgrade the, uh, upgrade the Guardian Armor. <laughs> yeah, playing the game without fast travel is... Uh, Really fun at home, but not a great idea for streaming, unfortunately. Because <laughs> one of my favorite things about this game is the overland travel and how it uh, just kind of, you know, really makes you engage with the world. Also, we have, um, like, uh, what is it? Um, there's some kind of mode for this game. Wait, am I going completely the wrong direction? I am. Uh, there's some kind of mode for this game that lets you basically see the path you've taken. And it's more cool to see your, you like moving across overland than it is to, you know, just sort of see you teleporting between towers. Nice. Oh, hello. You... Oh, right, Frank, I said I was gonna find your missing wife. Uh, that's still on the table, Buster Brown. I'm just, you know, I've been busy. <laughs> This time, let's take the stairs instead of the decorative slip and slide. Whoops. Okay. Alright, yeah, we're gonna go all the way up there. And, um, let's we'll see if we can find more of those. Oh, let's talk to the guy who wanted us to find those things. You know, the guy with the things. Yeah, that guy. Because that might give us a hint of how many of them we've already found. Because I have no idea. Hello, sir. Ah. Link, eh? What is wrong? Ah. Yes, tell me. Oh. It's in this area here. Ah. Beneath the cliff south of Rallis Pond. Oh, we said we were going to kill that Hinox, didn't we? Or Hinox, or whatever. Oh. Oh. Jeez, really? Okay, cliff south of Rallis Pond. Oh, we wanted to do the, uh, <clears throat> we want to do the Rallis Pond thing anyway, so. Mm, yeah, okay, we can make it there. Awesome. Okay. <clears throat> we'll head there, kill the Hinox, find that thingy, move on with our lives. And if we get to 6k, we're going to go get the, uh, the sluttiest outfit in the game. Hmm. We could also upgrade the Sheikah Slate. And, uh go back to the uh, uh, Korok Forest to show that little guy the ice rod, which I'm sure he'll appreciate. God. <laughs> so 
sorry, all the funny comments about the, the slutty outfit being automatically caught by YouTube's, like, I don't know if that's kosher algorithm. <laughs> Good, the sun's setting, and we can either spot the luminous stones with absolutely no downsides or annoying things that happen when the sun goes down in this game. I think now that we're done swimming up waterfalls, it's time to get back our regular dew. Wait, hold on. Oh, no! I made a mistake. Terrible mistake. There we go. Thank goodness. <laughs> oh man, I'm so excited specifically for whatever armor set in Tears of the Kingdom lets us have our hair down. I think they knew exactly what they were doing when they put that in the first trailer. <laughs> it's kind of like what they did with um with How to Train Your Dragon 2, you know? You guys remember where Hiccup has like the helmet on the whole time and then he takes it off and it's like, oh, he's gorgeous. <laughs> like they knew what they were doing. Let's see. Where are some luminous stones? Come on. Show me. Show me the big money. This feels needlessly perilous. Let's go back. I thought dealing with Varuda would get rid of the weather issues in this area, but uh, I suppose we are all still subject to the whims of the almighty algorithm. Oh, yes. Uh, is that what I want? Might be. Come on, baby. No, just regular rocks. Boo! Oh. There we go. Nice. Whoop, easy. Oh no, my sledgehammer. Hey okay, awesome. We're good. We can get another diamond. But first, let's do that Rallis Pond thing. Kill that thing, do the thing, let the guy know we found the thing. Point eight K raised, very nice. So when we hit six K, we're gonna head back to the Gerudo Desert and uh, get the get the Gerudo outfit. Um, don't think I have anything yet set down for seven. Where's the highlights? Oh, there he is. 
All right, let's see how much we can do before he wakes up. A lot of hearty radish I see down there. Hey, Van, what's up? <laughs> this poor deer doesn't know what to do. Whoop, oh no. You should do. You should wake up a little bit. All right. You know what? If he's gonna be asleep. Who am I to deny myself the benefits of an ambush? Very, very quiet. Oh God! No, I wanted to do a charged attack. Fine, whatever. Hey, big man. Shins is protected. Weak sauce, bro. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Easy, easy. Hey, that's cheating. You hear me? Oh, I don't think he's listening. isn't it really yeah oh no come on man all right whatever one last hit cool oh nice fish and wood salmon nice okay cool all right that was fun where did you say the thing was south of no north Morales pond south of Morales pond oh there it is okay cool cool wait no it isn't Wait, wait. I have confusion. Now, man, I'm doing side quests. Oh, for bro. <laughs> Great, awesome. Yeah, no, why would this be easy? Why would anything be easy? Uh... Huh. Did I accidentally quick change to a different bow? You can't see me, I'm invisible.
Oops, sorry. Okay. Yeah, might as well get this thing out of the way. Great. Okay. Fun. Okay. Where is this stupid thing? Oh, nearly missed the treasure chest. And all these cool weapons. Nice, 100 bucks. Let's just get rid of this. We're looking for the, um, the Zora monuments. Uh, the guy we talked to said that one of them was south of Rallis Pond. We are currently south of Rallis Pond. I don't see a monument. I'm getting frustrated. I worry if we go too far south, we'll just be completely out of the... Is it up there? Is that what that is? God damn it. I can't tell. So much of Zora's domain just randomly gro glows. <laughs> seem to change my mind, however. Okay, well, I don't think we're finding this one right now. We're just gonna go back. Whatever. The thing is, like, the Coblins are fully sentient, and they do have a sense of community. They also try to murder us on sight, and they might be being mind control on mass by Ganon, trapped in a sort of cursed unlife. So like, yes, it's kind of cool that they aren't just like flat, mindless zombie things. But also I don't feel super guilty about killing them in this game. Also, they attack random travelers uh, and then dance on their bodies, so, you know, like, there's moral complexities in some Zelda games. There's moral complexities in parts of this game, I think. Not really in the Bokoblins. Hey. Yes, sorry, it made me stinky. Whoa! hundred more bucks! Uh. <laughs> Alright, what else are we dealing with? Um... Mm. Our monument's still annoying. Freezing Rod! Yeah! May as well take care of that one. While we're bouncing around the map. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's so pretty at night. If it's even visibly at night. Hmm, maybe I'll do some memory hunting while we're here. Well, not while we're here, but you know, while we're in places. There you are. But you're going to have to equip it to impress me. Oh, okay. Ha! Ah, oh, get a load of the good stuff. Whoa! We're making bank on doing nothing today! Great, awesome. Alright, let's see. Ha! <sighs> what do we got? Okay. Found that memory, that memory. Okay. That one's on Death Mountain. That one's in, I think the forest's near Highwood Castle. Uh, well, for that, we'd probably just bounce around between the, um, the stables. Okay, let's see. Mm. 
Take care of that. Okay, he was in the northwest. Hmm. Let's do some slate upgrades. We got plenty of stuff. May as well. Just checking off boxes, baby. No, I wanna I wanna warp there. Why must you make this difficult? There we go. Whoa! Wow! Uh, well, thanks for the $200 anonymous donation. Uh, as mentioned before, we are, once again, fundraising for Direct Relief. Uh, they are a charity that handles um, a lot of disaster relief. Uh, and unlike a few of them, they uh, are not owned by the Turkish government, which means earthquake relief done by Direct Relief actually goes to earthquake relief. So that's fun. Uh, but as promised, thanks to reaching 6k, we're gonna go and get the Gerudo outfit, which I think we have enough money for now. Hello. Wait, what? Ah, there we go. Do I not have enough painting materials? I thought I did. Ah. Yeah, I think we can upgrade everything. Yes, let's do it. Snap. Yeah. Okay. Whew. All right, we're gonna get these upgraded and then we're gonna go back to the Gerudo Desert. Get the outfit that means we won't die in the sun. Yeah. Nice. Cool. Okay. <laughs> oh no. <sighs> yeah, Simon, I'll think about it. For now, I'll upgrade the rest of my rooms, please. a lot of work to make all these environments feel very lived in you know it's things you don't even notice but it's like there's books and papers on the floor this place is messy you know a lot of it's repurposed tech um yeah Okay, one more upgrade. Change of materials. Stasis. Now we can stasis guardians, briefly. Snap! Okay. Woohoo! Nice. I wonder 
if they were originally going to make Stasis Plus versions for Magnesis and Cryonis too, but they just couldn't think of something for it to do. Yeah. Aw, oh, shucks. Not even Calamity Ganon! Alright, thanks. Bye! Alright. Back to Gerudo Desert. In fact, let's go straight to Gerudo Town? No. No, let's just do the tower and then we can go to Karakara from there. Oh boy. Yeah, Cryonis Plus letting you make taller pillars or more pillars would make sense. But I think then they'd have to redesign a lot of the puzzles. Oh, for crying out loud, you big baby. Look, we'll just head straight down and you will stop freezing immediately. She is. <laughs> Foreboding and malicious as ever. <laughs> maybe if we hit maybe if we hit 7k before I leave this region, we can see what happens if you go near Vana Boris without having started the quest line. <laughs> to do Vana Boris than we are to do Viridania, since we don't have the full Flame Breaker set. It's a possibility. Perhaps we can make that the 10k goal. Perhaps next time we try and do Vana Boris. Because the thing is, here's the thing, spoiler alert, after we do all four Divine Beasts, we're not going to finish the game immediately. What we're going to do is we're going to do the Champions Balance stuff and continue doing more, you know, power-up stuff. When we beat Calamity Ganon, I want it to be in, like, under a dozen hits, if we can manage it. I think that would be very fun and cool of us. And trust me, the Champion's Balance stuff really reminds you that, uh, the difficulty curve on the rest of the game is not steep. It's very generous, in fact. Wait, nope, there he is. <laughs> Hello. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hi. <laughs> Do you need something from me? Hmm? You've heard about a man who snuck into Gerudo Town. Oh. I don't know anything about him. Sorry I couldn't be more help. Study her face. Ah. You're very beautiful. Mm. <laughs> and I'm sure you agree that these clothes only help my looks, right? Now that I think about it, this style would look quite fetching on you, as would most others. I'll have to charge, of course, but I bet people would see you completely differently if you wore them. Yeah. Gender presentation's a hell of a drug. Oh my god, wow, we- wow! <laughs> that really worked out very well for us. I didn't remember what the what they cost. Oh. I have the perfect outfit for you. Go ahead and change into it right now. Don't worry, I'll look away. Well, that's nice of you. Aww. <gasps> We're gorgeous. Aww. Mm. Zelda's like, Link, 
You're absolutely rocking that look. Oh. Glad I was able to help you out. Mm -hmm. Huh. <laughs> Make sure you watch out for the wind. That's <sighs> yeah, okay. Mm. Come back anytime. All right. So what color should we dye these? <laughs> I mean, like... We know. We know what color we have to dye these. In fact, we're gonna go do it right now. <laughs> Let's see, what's that quest line? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, now we can just get into Gerudo Town. In fact, well, we do have some sporbs to spend. Yeah, let's do that first. And I'm going to demonstrate to you guys that thing I mentioned earlier about how, like, obviously, probably as intended, this is some, this is one of them there tropes of gender that they didn't necessarily put the, the most thought into, you know, so that's just kind of how it works. Um, but I'm going to show you what happens if we try and get in as we normally dress. Oh, and then we can get the diamond from the guard. Oh. Savata. Oh. Wait, uh, you're a Vo! But we're forbidden here at Gerudo Town. Only Vi are allowed inside. Vi? Hmm? When I say Vi, I mean woman, obviously. Uh. You don't even know the difference between Vo and Vi. You're trying to enter town? Mm. Goodbye. All Vo must leave at once. Alright, hold right. Stay right there. There we go. But you are fine. Please relax and enjoy your time here. Vo? Oh. What was a word in Gerudo language that means man? There are many other Gerudo words, and it would help to learn them if you plan on entering Gerudo Town. <laughs> but you should at least remember Vo and Vi. Oh. Stop by the canteen, do yourself a favor, and order a noble pursuit. Alright. Evening, ma'am. See what I mean? This is one of those gameplay and story integration things where, depending on how you want to read it, <laughs> it's so clearly like, oh, okay. <laughs> You forgot to put on your gender presentation for the day. I see how it is. Alright, where's our... Where's the statue? I know the goddess statue is way out of the way. Aha! Here it is. So... Mm -hmm. What's a bow doing here? Oh! Ah! Oh! Mm-hmm. Kind of like they avoid me. Oh, that's... <laughs> rough? Mm. Thanks, Muava. Hello, Goddess Hylia. <laughs> Get a second full stamina wheel, baby. We got the outfit. Wait, wait a minute. What's that? Hey, come back here. Hey, nice. Whoop, okay. Alright, let's see. Nice. Oh, 
Okay. Great. Okay, we got the outfit. Um, we're gonna dye it a fun color, and then mm, let's see what other side quests I still have floating around. <laughs> Sorry, the the title of the stream is relevant to what we were doing at the beginning, but we already beat Varuda and kind of finished most of Zora's domain. Although we have to go back there soon because I forgot to trade in my 10 luminous stones for another diamond so that we could get the diamond and upgrade the guardian circlet. It's a whole thing. You know how it is. Great. All right. We're looking fabulous and we are ready to uh, change the outfit color. Pardon me? Okay. Hello. <laughs> Who do you do? Hey. Oh, wait. We have no money again. <laughs> Dang it! You'd think I'd get better at this by now. <laughs> I always thought the perpetually broke heroes thing was an unrealistic hey. trope of various anime. But no, turns out that's absolutely how things work. Hey, I have things to sell. Alright, we just need like 14 more rupees, so... Yeah, I've got a bunch of these. Okay, enjoy oh. the organ. Nope. Alright, bye! Oh, nice, the Master Shirt's back in action. Okay. Hey <laughs> Yes, die. All right. Hey. <laughs> That's the Hateno tradition. Choose a color. Ooh. Ooh, that's a little bit of an eyesore. That one's pretty nice. Hmm. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Most of these don't look better than the original. Kind of do like the goth one, though. No! Choose again. Nah, it's okay. Let's see, do I have the things? Yes! Oh, oh jeez. I have to use hardy tr- Oh, I can also use flit, thank god. If I had to use hardy truffles to dye it black, I would be so bummed. Okay. Now we're edgy and goth. Alright, thanks, man. Great, alright. Let's put our regular outfit back on for now. And then let's go... Back to Zora's Domain. We're gonna trade in those diamonds with that guy. Nope, that's the wrong way. And then, uh, I think getting the, um, getting the guardian armor upgraded, uh, would be good. So that means we need more gears, <laughs> which means we probably need to go back to the Forgotten Temple and kill everything in it again. Fantastic. Back in business. Oh, excuse me, sir. Mm -hmm. Did I 
here with your side quests. Yes, hello. Did you need something from me? Here are the stones. Oh. Thank you. You're really giving me ten lumen stones? In that case, please excuse me while I count them. Oh. And a one! Oh. And a two! Oh. And a three! Oh. Four! Oh. Five! Oh. Six! Oh. Seven! Oh. Eight! Oh. Nine! Oh. And ten! Oh. oh my, you really brought all ten. Thank you. Yes, I will happily take these lumen stones from you. Oh, that's right. I must reward you. Yeah! Hmm. Perf. All right, later, man. Where's the nearest great fairy fountain? Ah, probably this one. <laughs> this is, uh, I like to think of it as karmic retribution for you guys counting in my live chat all through last stream for some reason that's completely beyond me. I feel like they... The game designers on that one were like, yeah, we're going to give a way for the player to get more diamonds if they need them. Like, they're going to need to do some work for it, but diamonds are useful for upgrades, so yeah, we'll do that. Um, and they were like, yeah, but that sounds like a really good deal. How do we make it so they don't abuse it? Oh, you know. Let's just make it tortuously slow. <laughs> sure. Ah, I should have known. No. Miss Scoozy. Hey, girl. Ooh. Let me see your clothes. Oh. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, because we killed all those red choo choos. Oh, and we got some worms to clean up my own. <gasps> oh, okay. We can upgrade one of them, but not the other. Oh boy, here it comes. <laughs> 18 is not bad. Yeah, that'd be a good idea. We can only upgrade one of them. So let's upgrade the pants, because we have to keep wearing oh. those anyway. We're gonna do the. We're gonna do the cuirass, and then, uh. Yeah, then I think we are gonna go to the Forgotten Temple. Just get seven more ancient gears. Actually, let's see, um. Let's see what it would take to upgrade these to level three. No, wait. Come back. Tell me. Tell me how could it. Come on, man. All right, don't go anywhere. Yeah, sorry. Just, yeah, I know, just tell me. Take a look. All right, guardian armor. Ah, needs more ancient cores. I feel like we get those by killing guardian stalkers. Oh, and this one I can't upgrade until we awaken great... Fairy Terra. These ones need more Lionels. Anything interesting? Oh yeah, and those just candy pants. Okay. It's neat. Cool. <sighs> so long for now, I suppose. Alright, bye. <gasps> okay. I think... Okay, guys. I think it's 7k. We're gonna go kill a bunch more taluses. Does that sound good? Because I think it would be good to have just a, a lot more money. It would be nice to have the Great Fairy Terra back. Because um, then we can upgrade things to level 4. Uh, the highest armor level in the game. The 6k objective was getting the Gerudo armor set. Or the, the clothing set. Time. All right, so I can get 
this out of their system first. <laughs> they always all wake up right when I get here, even though they can't see me. Ancient cores there. Oh, we can always check out the field. Let's go back to that one Akala region after it regenerates. on the serious armor. Nah, we're fine. One and two. Okay. While we're exploring. So, uh, there's a Celtic video that I recommend you guys check out called um, something like The Mystery of Breath of the Wild's Forgotten Temple. Ah, uh, there's three. I see. Uh... And I do highly recommend it. It's very good. Because it's all about why the Forgotten Temple seems to be built on the Skyview Temple from Skyward Sword. Uh, there's a lot of details that line up. The lore is that this temple contains the oldest statue of the goddess. The oldest statue of the goddess would almost certainly be the one from Skyward Sword. So, that makes sense. The statue is also friggin' enormous. Um, the arrangement of the temple is pretty much the same. The pillars are all in the same place. Uh, whoops! Distracted by archaeology. My bad. Um, and uh, where's that tree? There it is. Uh, in uh, Skyward Sword, you plant a tree, uh, the Tree of Life. To uh, there's some time travel fuckiness in Breath of, uh, in uh, Skyward Sword. Uh, the dragon Lineru is. Uh, there are parts of the game where you can essentially travel back to the past. Um, you need to get the three dragons to help you with a thing, but the dragon Lineru is dead in the present. You can travel to the past when he's not dead, and he's like, yeah, uh, the fruit of the tree of life is what I need to survive. Um, but uh, it can't grow in this desert soil, so you need to take the, the seed, plant it in the past, go to the future where it's grown and has a fruit, take the fruit, back to past, feed it to the dragon Lanero, and then he's okay. Um, so, th where you plant it in the temple lines up exactly with, uh, basically the wall that that big tree has broken through. So. Oops. So. It's pretty cool. Anyway. Very good video, well worth the watching. Alright, we got any left? We're good. Well, we have none left in this section.
got something good to do after this. Um, I said something for 7k, and now I don't remember what it was. So, the question about the Forgotten Temple, why there's so many guardians in it, I believe in the design doc or something, it says that um, the idea was to make a place that was so old that, like, the guardians that were in it had been put there to protect it. Uh, so these guardians weren't unearthed, they didn't skitter their way in here. They were just corrupted by Ganon in place. Giant tree busting through. There's another one in the other room, right? Huh, neat. Alright, how many go? How many left? Oh, and of course, same rules as we did last time we did this. If we hit uh, the next milestone by before I leave, I'll try and parry the last one instead of just killing it. So that would be 7k. Oh boy. Close <laughs> one. Check out the tree in a little more detail once I get these guys done. <laughs> Nimbly dodged. The cat like tread. Alright. Well, maybe I'll just do it for fun anyway, see if I can. Whoop! Maybe I won't do it for fun. Hey, Mifa, check this out! Whee! Hmm, interesting. No, I really thought that that was gonna work eventually. That's okay. Whoop. Okay, Link. I need you to be facing the guy. Thank you. Alright, one more time. Now I just feel weird not doing it. Hey, say that to my face, bitch. Hmm. Has this gotten harder, or am I just bad? Perhaps this is my hubris. Did I do it? No, I just said caught fire. Okay. <laughs> to get good at this. There we go! Ha! Ah. It's like a like a microsecond too far in either direction and it doesn't go well at all. Hylian Shield holds up beautifully though. Okay! Is that all of them? That's all of them. Great! Alright, let's check out the tree. work, Link. <laughs> Let's try that again, but with less sucking this time. Huh. Neat. Yeah, so it's just like busting straight through the stone wall. Hmm. And it is not the kind of tree that you can cut down, which makes sense. Let's see. 
Well, I believe that's, uh... Oh, and here we go. Uh... More loft wing designs. See? I believe that's the loft wing. So, this is all Skyward Sword era stuff, which is very cool. Anyway, I believe that's, uh, that's that sorted out. So, let's go to a great fairy. Um... Oh, and we should check in with Terrytown, because we sent somebody their way. So, we'll just do this one. get more sporbs too. Ah, jeez. Ugh, it's always something. Okay. Great fairy. Hello, excuse me. Oh yeah, 7k was we go and start killing taluses. I remember. I know there's some special ones I've never dealt with before. There's that igneo talus on the way to Death Mountain that we avoided. Um, there's somewhere, I guess, there's a uh, Luminous Talus, which I've never Ooh. fought before. Oh. Perfect. Yes, okay. And, right, we need ancient cores for the cuirass. Yes, please. I think I did not say Naboris at 7k. I think I said Naboris at 10k. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Alright, bye! Town. Wherefore art thou? There it is. Oh, it's, it's coming together beautifully. Look at that. Hello. Ooh. So, I found someone from the Gerudo. She's pretty uh, amazing. Ah. Homes, thirty bundles of wood. Oh, Hudson, I can never say no to you. Oh, let's check on the weapons, Bronson. Oh yeah, and this uh, this is where you can get the Gerudo bow armor, armor, which I believe I've mentioned. I didn't realize was a real armor set in the game. Those kind of look cool though. Hello. So up. Oh. Uh-huh. Well, that's depressing. All right, well, have fun. Uh, I'm just going to take this, if you don't mind. We're theoretically going to be killing Taluses soon, and I need it, and I don't need this anymore, so... Oh, or maybe I could just get rid of my broken sledgehammer. All right. Well, I think the Guardian Stalkers are gone, because we killed them and there hasn't been a Blood Moon since then, I want to say? Well, perfect time to find out. Yeah, I think we're good. Which is a shame, because we do need more Ancient Cores. But that's okay. Sir. Yep. Boy, that works great. <laughs> All right, where was I? Yep. Boy, he 
these things really work better now that they're upgraded. Yep. I love that short charge time. Love that longer range. Nice. How many do we need? Okay. 26 more. Easy. Oh, let's see. So, as a reminder, we are fundraising for earthquake relief, continuing in Turkey and Syria, because you may have heard a few weeks back they got absolutely walloped by an earthquake and it was really, really bad. Um, yep. So Direct Relief, which is a charity we worked with before because they're just great, um, are raising money to try and help out there. Uh, and we've just sort of been... Oops. Well, that was a waste of a bomb. Uh, we've been consistently... Uh, trying to fundraise for them on these streams because, you know, I would probably be playing this game anyway, and uh, the fact that I can potentially uh, have, like, a tangible good effect while also playing this game is quite nice. So, um, the current next goal is if we hit 7k raised, we're gonna aim to just go and kill a bunch of taluses. Kind of dealer's choice on that one. Uh, because there's been a, a blood moon since we did the last uh, Talus killing spree, so most of them are back, so that could be fun. Um, and, uh, yeah, currently the sort of tall ask uh, uh, end, end game goal, because the odds are good that I'm gonna... I know I say this every time. I am probably going to aim to end this stream on the hour. Uh, you know, a nice, clean six hours. Call it a day. Um, yep. And... So the 10k goal for next time would be doing the Vanaburos yep. quest line, which involves cleaning out the Yiga clan hideout, uh, which is going to be a nightmare. A fun nightmare, but a nightmare. Um, so yeah, that's the shoot the moon goal. And if you're watching this as a VOD, that uh, goal, well, I guess you'll be able to tell if that goal is still up, because you'll be able to see if we've surpassed 10k or not. And I'd get the full armor, but I currently have no money, so we gotta we gotta get back on that first. Oh, there's something so mesmerizing about just clear cutting a forest with bombs. This is the second time I've said something that sounds like a fucking Captain Planet villain. Just offhandedly. Ooh. Well, thank you to Kenwood for donating a hundred dollars to direct relief. That's very generous of you. And that gets us closer to the Talus extermination speed. You guys are going to need to guide me towards them, though. I only remember where a couple of them are from last time. There's the ones on Dueling Peaks, which are always a party. There's, um, there's that one out in the crater by Rito Village that I found eventually. Uh, that was fun. We... Okay, yeah, we're nearly there. Excuse me. <laughs> Not loud. One of those just despawn. Huh, wild. Oh no, they just disappeared. Okay. I can see if there's some memories around here, too. I don't know if there's anyone here. But we already got rid of the more distinctive ones. Whoops. Hey, no, I need that wood. Damn it, you guys. Oh god, the wind caught it. No! Shoot! <laughs> Damn it! Ah, uh, fine, whatever. Oh 
God, it's raining key spits. Hallelujah. All right, yep. awesome. Yep. Oh, we're getting there. <laughs> we're creeping up yep. on it. Oh, um, so I, I don't know, I guess it feels a bit like subtweeting, I don't want like doing that, but um, when I do uh, the little like pre-stream announcements on uh, YouTube, uh, most of you guys are perfectly lovely, uh, I will occasionally get a comment from someone that's like taking a really accusatory tone while also making it very clear that this person has not actually done any of the donations to charity that we've been facilitating. <laughs> um, because on one of them, it was like, it, we were arranging, you know, hey, we're, we're going to be streaming for Direct Relief again. And they were like, uh, is that sponsored by the Turkish government? Because if so, you just scam these people out of $10,000. And it's like, oh, cool. Tell me you haven't been watching the VODs without telling me you haven't been watching the VODs. Um, and for the one for this week, uh, someone was like, show us proof you donated it all. It's like, the proof is that we never, the money goes through YouTube giving. We don't get it. <laughs> you guys donated it all. We haven't touched it. So, anyway, it's very funny. I don't know what the, what it is about the internet that makes people just really casually hostile. It's like, guys, this is, <laughs> this is, this is you guys doing good. We're just sort of providing entertainment while you do. <laughs> Okay, let's go back to Terrytown. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, I pre-ordered Tears of the Kingdom the other day. Couldn't resist any longer. There's no universe in which I'm not getting that game. Honestly, even if it's busted on launch, it's like, well... They'll patch it, and I'll have it. I'll have my precious. Hey, yo. Dead. Sure. I'm a lifesaver. You're darn right, sir. Well, next is... Which is exactly why I need to set up some distribution. General store. Traveling trader? You don't can fly around. Huh. This seems like a real long shot. One last wrinkle. According to the official Bolson construction policy, that someone's name must end in sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I actually know who that is, and we've actually already talked to them in this game. Um, I guess we could do that now. Like, really, what else have we got going on? Well, let's see what other side quests we've got. Uh, round up. To the customer. Oh, God, the, the darn thing. Hold on, do we actually have all those now? Probably not. Ah, no, we still don't have an electric darner. I should have known. Would have been too easy. Okay, yeah. Most of our other side quests are just sort of chilling at this point. Hmm. Yeah, then, uh... Well, let's just go get that guy, then. May as well. Can't hurt to finish Terrytown.
at, dude? Uh, he's chilling. Far down this stupid mountain peak thingy. There he is. Hello. Dreams of better things. Fison, if that is your real name. Oh. I have bigger problems. My mom said she wants me to take over the family store someday. Can you believe that? I don't I want to just help. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. Oh. But I don't want to compete with mom. I wish there was a place I could set up my own shop. Ever heard of Terrytown? Terrytown? Tell me more. Well, you see... Oh, it's there near the general store. That's perfect. But the Akala region is pretty far out there. If only I could fly. <coughs> anyway, I guess I gotta leave the nest someday to have my own store. <laughs> okay, I made up my mind. I'm going. I'll gather some items on the way to Terrytown and then sell them at my new shop. Uh... Thanks for the tip. And hey, don't be a stranger. Come visit me at my new home sometime. Well. I really thought he was gonna fly out of there. Don't know why, in hindsight. <laughs> we're actually pretty close to that Talus I said we were gonna fight. Ah, no, later. I think we need to go get him 50 bundles of wood this time or something. <laughs> Ay, sheesh. Well, you know, can't hurt to take care of. Oh, and we're at 6.6k already. Very nice. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boy, he's speedy. He's gonna be already there when we arrive, I guarantee it. I'm still curious about why and how exactly this landmass formed. <laughs> but, you know, it's Zelda. Maybe a goddess put it here. It's kind of the standard explanation. Hello, sa. Oh. So. Yep. Wow. He left like two minutes ago. Should really go check out the store. Next is. Uh huh. Yep. 40 bundles? Oh, 50 bundles. Even better. Sure. Yeah, 50 bundles of wood I can do. Why not? You know what? Hey, can... Can I sell stuff? Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Good day. I came to sell... <laughs> Why wouldn't he let me do that from the table? <laughs> I'm just trying to, you know, be efficient. Alright, what's good? What's good, little homie? Okay, let's, uh... Heck yeah. Uh... Let's get rid of a few of these. to go kill some taluses. <clears throat> See you next time, kiddo. Oh, who's this person? Oh, huh. Hello? I'm a traveler. Commoners. I'm guessing you're a little hard up for cash, am I right? Yes. A down payment? And? <laughs> Thanks? Uh huh. Yeah. Huh. Oh, I killed those already. And they haven't come back yet. Have they come back? Do they just respawn because of this rich asshole?
Well, I mean, we need to go there for the wood anyway, so I guess we'll see if the guardians are back. <laughs> Adventure! God, that's so funny. Maybe we'll just have to wait for a blood moon? Well, anyway, back to business. Yeah. Wonder what Zelda thinks of that guy. <laughs> Link, I know your heroic nature is kind of a reflex at this point, but you really don't need to do what any random asshole asks you to do. <laughs> <clears throat> Well, when I go back to drop off the wood, I'll just talk to him again, see what happens. I know some of these quest lines get a little confused if you accidentally do them out of order, so... I hope that uh, if those flying island things in Tears of the Kingdom are just like chunks of the map lifted up. <clears throat> I hope Terrytown is one of them. <laughs> and we can just hang out with them. I feel like Hudson would take that in stride. Like, yeah, property values are through the roof ever since the uh, whole town up and started flying. I'm gonna need 70 bundles of wood. Sorry, beasts of the forest. I, the trees will be back next blood moon, I think. Yep. Alright. Oh, we got a ways to go. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> well, while we're doing this chat, anything interesting happening? Yep. Any fun ideas for future side quests or... Challenges, fun talus locations, if we manage to hit 7k before I call it a day. Why don't you stream on Twitch? Uh, well, the short answer is, um, why bother when we can just stream on YouTube? <laughs> uh, we've had the YouTube account for, I, I want to say, longer than Twitch has been a mainstream platform. I don't know if it's, I don't know if Twitch is older than the channel, but I know Twitch has not been big for longer than uh, we've had the channel. Um, so basically by the time we started thinking about just live streaming for fun, um, the idea of making a second thing and doing it on Twitch just didn't really make sense. Um, and since we're mostly doing this for like a fun side thing uh, and not to like make money directly, as it were. Like, you know, there's no incentive to do, like, Twitch Primes and subs and stuff like that. Uh, like, some of the... Some of our uh, streams we've done things like Super Chats on, but we have those disabled uh, right now. And when you do a charity stream, they just all get routed straight into the charity. Um, also, I was talking with... Um, <laughs> With, uh, with Joe Cat and some of the, uh, some of the Heart of Olympi crew the other day, uh, about Twitch streaming, because it's not really something we've ever really done, and, uh, the vibe I get is that it's a bit of a thankless job. Uh, like, obviously, I'm having a great time live streaming. The people who make a living live streaming, uh, impress me enormously. But from what I've heard about how Twitch works as a platform, it seems a little bit thankless, um... In large part because the uh, it doesn't save vods, you know, it not for more than like 60 days, and they don't monetize vods, which is a thing you can do on YouTube. Um, you can uh, uh, monetize vods of former streams, and then you know, as long as people still watch the vod, you still make something out of it. Um, and Twitch just 
doesn't do that, which means if you're not actively streaming, you're basically not making a living, which I understand. You know, I, I suppose that like most jobs work that way. Like if you are not actively working, you are probably not actively getting paid. But that's not really how YouTube works. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Uh, absolutely no shade to the the people who Twitch stream. I think those guys are incredible. Um, but Twitch itself as a platform seems a little bit not fantastic for the people who are, you know, making a living off of it. Uh, so overall, not much incentive for us to deviate away from the channel that we have that has the audience, uh, you know, all you lovely folks who seem to enjoy this for reasons that I'm very grateful for, even if I can't understand them. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know, I guess that's general. We have a Twitch account that we use to, like, watch and subscribe to stuff and um, comment on things sometimes, but... Yeah, streaming there, never really appealed. I also, as I understand it, people who were Twitch partners until very recently were not allowed to stream anywhere else. Uh, and that just feels dubious to me. <laughs> um, like, there's nothing inherently shady about, like, a non-compete co contract. But, um, when it comes to, you know, making online content, there's something a little bit shady about it, you know? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Very much not really my area of expertise, so... Yep. We're getting there. Boy, it's gonna be weird when this all comes back next blood moon. Why is combat noises happening? Oh, I'm getting attacked by wolves again. Sheesh, guys. Take a hint. Whoops. music really thinks something dramatic is happening. Oh, I suppose something dramatic is happening a little bit. Nice. Well, that was easy. Okay, anyway, back to business. Close. Getting real close. <laughs> ah, so soothing. So peaceful. How beautiful the sunset is. me right now. Mm. I believe in this universe the Lorax must be an agent of Ganon yep. because the trees are part of the things that reset uh, blood moons, if I recall correctly. As I understand it, a blood moon will essentially reset, I, I want to say, anything that isn't like a shrine or like a divine beast or something to its kind of base state. Um, so all the enemies respawn, but also a lot of other stuff happens, which is why... Um, Speedrunners will sometimes encounter what I believe they call panic blood moons, where the game is out of memory and triggers a blood moon at a very unusual time to sort of do a, like a hard reset on everything. All right, there we go. Perfect. We might be able to finish Terrytown today, actually. Um... Oh, trees just come back whenever? That's good. Hmm. 
it's ready. Thanks, Mipa. What's your favorite area in Hyrule? Hmm. That's a good question. <laughs> I think I really do like the Akala region. Uh, <clears throat> I like its its crisp autumnal vibes. Hello. Just a traveler. Huh. Okay, me. No, here's the wood. But yeah, um, I like the Akala Citadel. I like how they encourage you to go to Akala early, but it takes you a really long time to get up there because it's so far away. Oh, what's wrong? Oh, not that kind of person. Actually, I got engaged. No way! Congratulations! Thank you. To who? Bronson! You're a cute couple! She was complaining about how stinky you are just like ten minutes ago. Priest-like, huh? Mm. Suggest Zora. Good luck, you'll need it. This seems like a real long shot. Well, you know how I do. One last wrinkle? Yeah, that person's name must end in sun. Send them here to Terrytown for me. Okay. Let's talk to Ronson. Oh yeah, let's talk to the rich guy. Hey, wait, where'd he go? Am I in the wrong place? Shoot, there's all these weird little outlooks. I wanted to give you a congrats, but I guess I came to sell? Alright, cool. Let's just uh, offload something so she doesn't think we're rude. Um, uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, take it. Okay. Okay, bye. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna go buy the bow armor later. But first, where's the rich guy? There he is. Hey. I mean, yeah, they are dead. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I saw you. Aw, oh, shucks. Twenty rupees. Oh, hilarious. All right. Very worth it for 20 rupees. Love being belittled. All right, what do we got? 450. That one's pricey. 650. Okay. We can get the pants and the, the hair thing, but we can't yet get the spalder. So cool looking. Well, we'll get what we can get. Sell what we can sell. Okay. Let me see if the Great Fairy can upgrade these too. Oh, okay, good. I do have enough, but. Noise. Suits me. Thank you. This one, I, uh, this one's gonna be tough. All right. Um. Well, we are creeping up on seven k, which is pretty nice. Let's uh, let's just real quick run back to the Great Fairy, see what it takes to upgrade these bad boys. Um, because if we hit seven k, we're gonna start going for more taluses. Um, and we can also uh. If we have time to kill before that, we can go and get the last guy for Terrytown. We could just warp back there, but ah, I don't like abusing that. There's this is a thing that I've noticed with a lot of video games is that um, the existence of the fast travel system is like useful, but if you get really into the game, you kind of don't want to use it. Um, it's like, why is there a fast travel system in uh, Spider-Man PS4, you know? The whole fun of that game is the web-slinging. Like, 
It's cartoonish to see Spider-Man taking the subway. <clears throat> nope, absolutely not. Out of my way, bitch. Anyway, yeah, I'm glad that the fast travel exists in this game. The ability to warp back to shrines you've been to is great. But, like, when I start getting tempted to overuse the system, it makes me upset. Ew. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, yeah! Okay, so what's the sitch? Ah, okay. Okay. We can actually, I think, make more oh. red choo choo jelly. Oh, stop explaining set bonuses. <sighs> yep, okay. Yep, yep, yep. Alright. Okay. Let's see if my hunch was correct. Let's see. How much regular choo choo jelly do I have? Genius. Great fairy. Great fairy, I have more white choo-choo jelly. Woohoo! We hit 7k! Okay, fantastic. Let's see. Oh, wow. Alright. We're gonna, we're gonna do both of these things. I'm gonna make a little bit more white choo-choo jelly to make it work. Uh, and then we're gonna go kill some taluses. Guys, camel time is 10k. Taluses is 7k. Oh. No, no, please, the torment is unending. <laughs> More white choo-choo jellies. Then, taluses. <laughs> oh no, I missed. Oh god! <laughs> Great. Just according to Keikaku. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. Only this time, less slapstick comedy. Good, thank you. Just what I like to see. Oh no. Is it gonna happen again? Oh no, I think it only happens when you upgrade to level one. Alright. Perfect, we got enough for both. Okay, let's go kill some rocks. Oh, shucks, that's a shame. Yep, okay. Alright, bye. Alright, let's see. Well, to start off, let's do those ones on Dueling Peaks, I remember. Those guys, I actually remember how to get to. Let's see, which one is higher up? Ah, uh, yeah. 
Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna run past the hour again. As is my won't. Ooh, yes. And if you guys can tell me where the Luminous Talus near the Great Plateau is, I would love to break that thing. Oh, you're so right. I should absolutely stamp all the Talus locations. Oh, for crying out loud, you big baby! Fine. Whatever. We'll put on the nice pants. God. All right. Damn it, this isn't the one I wanted. Ugh. <clears throat> Gotta keep the jewels warm. No, I got the jewels on my head. Don't be silly. Okay. We good? Yeah, we're good. What the hell? Oh! Sir? Ow. Fine. Whatever. Screw you, man. I don't need you anyway. Let's see. Talus was, like, straight south of the peak, I think? Oh, yeah. When we get there... What the hell? Why are you guys spamming X? Okay. Alright. I know there's a talus on this side, because I remember we, we killed it last time. Oh, hold on. Oh no, now it's raining. Oh, I got a sneaking suspicion. And that saving is only confirming it. Yeah! Okay. Let's just, uh... Let's just... Oh, no, hold on. Okay. We're gonna change this to murder. Good. All right. Great. Let's kill it. Hmm, not being able to climb might make this a bit of a challenge. Oh well. <laughs> I think this is going to turn into the top part. Well, I thought correctly, but it didn't help. Oh, this is just the little guy. Oh, hold on. I remember something with this. Oh, no bomb arrows. Shoot. Well, that's okay. Let's see. Is that gonna... Nope. Okay, whatever. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, cool. Whoa, fellas. Excuse me. Hold on. Uh, let's just kill these things normal. Normal style. Squeak, squeak. Okay. Nice. All right, that was fun. Back to the top for round two. Oh yeah, and we can stasis them now. Yes, good. Oh, my power is maximum. All right, so we're gonna kill the th three of these, I think. Nope. What's the Yeah, okay. Laters. <laughs> oh, there's shrines down there. I should really mark those for later. And then I didn't. Alright. Anyway. Let's see, is it this area or the other one? Don't think it's this one yet. Oh yeah, I think there was just a whiz rope down there, or something. That's what it looked like anyway. There is the suspicious rock formation I've been looking for. Oh, you 
think you're slick. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, we're being so efficient. This is great. Let's change the correct weapon. And now, Banzai! One of these days I'm going to figure out how to stay on it when it stands up. It hasn't worked yet, but... Oh, do you think it'll let me break it while it's still on the ground? Nope. <laughs> no. Okay, phew! <laughs> oh, baby. This is feeling a little bit too easy. Oh, no. No! Come back! Oh, I forgot to try stasising it. That's my fault. Alright, are there any more on Dueling Peaks, or uh, have we exhausted the population? I feel like I remember there being another one. In my defense, they do try to kill me as soon as I show up. Uh, oh yes, yes, so you guys are going to need to direct me to how to find the luminous one. Ooh, Satori Mountain is glowing. Wait, is that, did I set a pin on Satori Mountain and then forget to get rid of it? Oh, I heckin' did. Alright, get out of here. I need more pins, dang it. I need to be able to use them. Okay. Okay, so. Where is the Luminous Talus? How do I reach it? And while we're doing this, should I go kill the one on the Great Plateau again? You know, always pretty fun. It's right next to the path to Hylia Bridge. Okay. Where's the Bridge of Hylia? Presumably there. Oh, so like, like Scouts Hill area? This place? So if we go here, you guys will be able to direct me. Is it underground or something? are just insufferable. All right. Oh! Oh! You know what we can do up here? Oh my god! Get, what the? Bro! Bro. Nope. Not dealing with that. But you know what we're in the right place to do? Where is it? There's an EX chest around here somewhere. Aha! I found it! Yes. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> we got the Nintendo Switch t-shirt. Oh, Nintendo, you self-congratulatory dickheads. I love this. Okay, where's the Luminous Talus? So, like, down here. Hmm, okay. Well, there's the bridge to Lake Hylia. You know, the Great Plateau isn't even that high up on this part. Well, okay. Hmm, those rocks popping in and out of existence have me suspicious. Perhaps I've simply become jaded. Yep, okay, those rocks are normal. Where's the weird rocks? Oh, hello. Person just standing around. Who are you and what are you doing? Mmm. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> Yiga clan member. <laughs> Absolutely not. 
Oh, was there a dragon flying out of the lake? Sorry, I missed it. Oh! Yeah, there it is. Boy, you big. Yeah, there he goes. Wow, so beautiful. So majestic. Alright, where's this luminous talus? Left? You guys might not be correct about this. Oh, so cool. He's having a little bath. Oh, for crying out loud, guys. Really? I'm trying to admire the beauty of nature. Like, Harshing my vibe. And I don't appreciate that. Wow. Aw, oh, look at that. He's having a little splishy splash. Hey, buddy. Oh, it's Nadra. You remember me? I shot you. Just taking a nice little, nice little dip. I want there to be more dragons in Tears of the Kingdom. God, it's huge! And then you, like, mentally compare that to the Leviathan skeletons we've been dealing with, and it's like, wow, like, that's huge, but it's nothing compared to those. I really thought Nadra was blue, not green. Maybe it's a trick of the daylight. I guess this could be Farash? I know Farash is green, but it has the face that I remember Nadra having. You guys sure? Hmm, I guess it could be. I don't know. Maybe all the dragons kind of have the same face. Nadra's got that, like, that poopy lip. Well, whatever. Anyway, where's that luminous talus you guys promised me? Oh, wait, yeah, I could just take a picture of it. Oh yeah, there it is, Farash. Huh. Weird. Okay. Anyway, Luminous Talus, folks. <laughs> Talus at crossroads. Really? It's just on the road. Oh! Okay. Sure. Yeah, fine. <laughs> Hello. Great, Flint. Love it. Hmm. Perhaps I can see it. Nope, that's just a regular rock again. Oh, Talos hunting makes me so paranoid. Wait, did I did I miss it? You guys are confusing me. Oh, it's auto-saving. That's a good sign, right? Only good things happen when you're auto-saving. stayed on top. Where's the glowy thing? Oh, fuck. What? Why is it? Why is it weird? Whoa. Oh, the health bar on this thing. All right, charge it up. Oh! Oh, he got me. My goodness. You know, this might have been the first talus I encountered, actually. Oh! Oh, I'm amazed that worked. <laughs> if 
fact, it almost didn't. Oh, Link, come on, bro. Whoa. Ah, he led my motions. Shoot. That's tough. Devastating. Uncool, Mr. Talus. Oh no, it's raining. <laughs> Tension. It's unbearable. something out. Did I do it? Nope, I did not. Whoop! Aww. I got sad on. Hmm. Oh, okay. This is useful. Make this work. Hey, bud, you should come this way. Goodness, the rain's clearing up. That's okay. Yeah, yeah, get it out of your system. All right, now I might be able to make this work. Link, I need to get up on him. Thank you. it on the ass is definitely not helping. Phew. Okay, cool. Now let's see. No! Damn it! God! Yeah, Bomb Arrows probably would have been a good investment for this. I think this is the first Talus I ever encountered in this game. I just remember running into something fresh off the Great Plateau, first playthrough, and dying to it repeatedly. <laughs> what? I was on your back! That's bullshit. Alright, what do we got? Oh, wait, hold on. Well, it doesn't last crazy long. Oh! Cool, that does work. Oh, that works very well, doesn't it? camera doesn't know what to do with this. Quick! 
before he shakes you off. being so clever. Well, that's okay. Come on, buddy. Figure this out. Looks like he's face planting. All right, and and there we go. Whoo, boy, that was a toughie. Heck of a health bar on that one. Wish I pulled out the champion's tunic so I could have seen exactly how spongy it was. Oh, and it was just a bunch of ambers and opals too. <laughs> Man! Well, I feel cheated. Okay, let's see. We can mark this place, though, for next time. Okay. Now, where was that one up by the Rito area in the craters? Where were those craters? Ah, there we go. Let's go beat that one up. That one I had more fun with. I think it dropped a luminous stone, uh, which I probably picked up without noticing. <laughs> kind of rough. Definitely not worth the cost. Okay. Eat. Eh, we got Mipha's Grace. Remember, she's always willing to heal our wounds. Diamond and two sapphires. Not too shabby. Okay, that was fun. Where's another weird one? Oh, yeah, we gotta mark this one. Just so we remember. Yeah. Okay. Oof. Okay, so that's senior, junior, uh, Gisa. And uh, the Luminous Stone one, which thus far has been the only really frustrating one.
Got any other weird ones? I remember there was another weird one we did last time, because we ended up getting, like, two taloses that each dropped two diamonds. Uh, I just can't remember where the other one was. It wasn't the, uh, lava one. Oh, we should get another sledgehammer. Yeah. Um, let's, uh, do we have any money? No. Great. Uh, let's dip back to Potato Village, because we know we can get a sledgehammer there. Um, sell a little stuff, maybe. Oh, there's, there's one on the plateau, but it's a normal one. Um... Oh, yeah, the, the path to Rito Village. Um, we could also go back and do that Igneo Talus. I think we have some ice arrows. Wouldn't be impossible. Um, I think we have some ice arrows. Yeah, and we got other ice weapons. We could hit it with it. Um, I never even thought to use ice weapons on Igneo Taluses. I would always just, um... Rivali's Gale is now ready. Thanks, Rivali. I, uh... <laughs> I would just... stand on him, tank the damage. <laughs> Wear the Flamebreaker armor and wonder why it wasn't working. <laughs> um... Alright. You guys said there was one near Hateno, right? Uh... Because we are also near Hateno. Like on the road down from it, or somewhere else? Well, let's see what following the road gets us. They usually put the taluses on the road just to mess with you. Every time I see a suspicious large rock, I am now, well, suspicious. Oh, hold on, forget all that stuff. That lovely little island down there. How pretty. Oh, I guess it's not an island. It's just like a little peninsula thing. Anyway. Uh, oh, yes. By the waterfall. I remember this conversation. Okay. Let's go do that one. In fact, let's go do that in style. <laughs> nice and quick. <laughs> yes, I know we're Flamebreaker armor would work if I had the set bonus, but it takes a while to upgrade it, so I didn't have the set bonus. Anyway, I think you might still take damage from it, even if you're not actively on fire. Nope. Sorry, Alice. I'm hunting meatier prey than you tonight. Wait, hold on. Ah. Fellas, excuse me. All right, great. Anyway, where was I? Oh yes, that's right. Nice. All right, let's go kill it. I think this is another normal one, isn't it? Climb the ass. Hold still so I can climb the ass! Mm. Climbing the ass is not cooperating tonight. Okay. No. Okay, great. Great. This was just another normal one, though. You know? Like. Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's see. <sighs> well, it's something good. Well, we could go back to Elden Volcano. 
put on the flame breaker armor, you know, see what happens when we kill an Igneo Talus. Uh, might be, might be fun. Oh yeah, Ice Talus. You said there was one of those near the flight range, right? We can go check that out. <laughs> Is this a Talus speedrun or something? I said for 7k we would go kill a bunch of Taluses. I didn't put a parameter on how much is a bunch, so we're just kind of going until I get tired of it. <laughs> uh, or until I make all the money in the world and can get the... Uh... Oh, hold on. Oh. Oh, okay. I'm wearing the correct pants and it still doesn't matter. All right, let's see. Um, um, um... See, you're fine. <laughs> Great. Okay. Where's the ice talus, folks? Uh, well, I suppose I can take a quick look around. Whoops. Nope. Why am I forgetting how to take pictures? There it is. Okay. Oh, hello, fellas. Horse, 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 horse. Neat. Okay, cool. So where's the ice talus? East. Oh, okay. So like up into the Hebrew Mountains a little bit? Well, I guess where I am. Whee! All right, cool. Where are we looking? All right, let's get up there. See what we can find. It's in Cold Snap Hollow, and also a side quest. Ugh. Well, maybe we can get there before the side quest. Let's see, is Cold Snap Hollow on the map? Corvash Peak. Hebrew South Summit. Eh. Well, it doesn't look like we've been there. It's like in a pit. Eh. See, we could eat something, or we could let Mipha's Grace do its thing. <laughs> Oh, that's Suspisco. All right, let's see. What do we got? Lost spear. A surplus of fire arrows. I think we're good. We're going to smite it into submission with our mighty guns. No, damn it. Why do you never let me... Oh, God! Uh, I've discovered a problem. The problem is it won't let me touch it. Oh. I knocked off you fair and square. Oh god! Thanks, Mipha! <laughs> oh god. Oh no, no! Ah. 
There we go. Sheesh. Whew. Oh, god damn it. All right, we're good. See? Everything's fine. Nice. All right, you missing anything? Nah, we're fine. Okay, that was fun. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh, we're, we're really piling them on. We could definitely sell some of these. We could also kill one more Talus. Let's see. Let's see. Let's, uh... Yeah. Oh no! I didn't pin it! No! That's ah, fine. We'll deal with it later. Cause it's like just up by the flight range and uh Alright, yeah. I'll I'll stamp in that general area. We didn't have much trouble finding it, so Alright. So we were like like here ish. Yeah. Great. Okay, anyway. Let's real quick put on uh, put the guns away. Alright. Now we're back in business. And if we're gonna look stupid, we may as well go all the way, right? Alright, where are we going? We are going. This way. Ooh, maybe maybe not straight through the lava, but like in that general area. Okay, yeah. Road's a little confusing, but we got it. We got it figured out. And yes, as we are coming up on the end of the stream, I promise this time for real. Uh, we uh, if this vod can hit 10k. By the next time I stream, we're gonna go and uh, hopefully do Ivana Boris, um, aka the scary robot camel. Let me just real quick get my last chunk of hard back. Come on, buddy. Come on, hot spring, work your magic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, awesome. Anyway, um,. Yeah, initially my plan was for Naboris to be the last one, uh, because Thunderblight Ganon is a huge pain in the ass. Um, but, you know, we can probably do it. And, uh, as mentioned, I do intend to do the Champion's Ballad quests, so... Spoiler alert, but, uh, that means you fight the Blights more than once. <laughs> so... Okay. All right, we gotta. Oh, hold on. We're here. Quicker than expected. Okay. Let's see. Nope, that's not what I. Mm, I see. Uh oh. Yeah. Okay. Sure. I think we can make this work. So, where in this big pile of lava rocks is the Igneo Talus? I think it's down there. Link. Link, buddy. Link. Link! <laughs> Boy, you are just desperate to get up close and personal with this fucking thing, aren't you? Okay, let's go. Let's get back up here. Let's just... Let's gonna, let's gonna take a look. We're gonna be smart. We're gonna be tactical. Look, I know it's not called the Triforce of Thinking Things Through. But come on, man. All right. Let's see what we can do. Oh god. Oh god. Oh! 
Oh, no, no, no. Get under it. Oh, beans. Oh, everything hurts. Oh, Mifa's Grace hasn't recharged yet. Hold on. <laughs> we can't be cavalier about this so much. Ooh, no, let's not eat that one. That's the best one. Oh, God. What's my camera doing? Oh, thank God. Okay. Spin to win, spin to win, baby! Yes! Oh, okay. Phew! Oh, that was dicey! Oh, boy, okay. Phew! Let's take these. Oh, and let's mark it on the map. Lest we forget. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> what I love about this is, uh, if you see in the bottom left, um, that error is normally where it puts the temperature. So if you're anywhere that will set you on fire, that's what it shows. Okay, let's see. Let's go sell this stuff. Ooh, you know what I just remembered? <laughs> Not to just one more thing myself into another just one more thing, but I actually do remember there's a there's a Gerudo woman who you can find in Goron, C Goron City who buys specific gems at better than market price. So if we can find her, we have like all the gems on us right now. So Basically, anything she wants to buy, we can sell her and make bank, and then we can sell everything else somewhere normal. So, let's just follow the road. Now that we're not about to get set on fire. Ooh. And let's also break some rocks on the way for even more gems. <laughs> yeah! Give me a lizard! Yes, thank you. Okay, incredible. Huh. <sighs> Oh, and then we can go and get the last person for the Terrytown quest, uh, because I know who that is. <laughs> Not to just three more things myself, but you know how it is. Hmm, why would it make me autosave here? Something gonna happen? Oh no, it's just those little balls. We're fine. How far do we have to go? Oh, that's not too bad. I don't think it's too bad. Hooray! One more marker and we're home free. <clears throat> Wait, does the rock woman only show up after you've done Redania? Uh-oh. Oh god! Oh god! Ah! Serpentine! Serpentine! Oh. Alright, we're good. You know, it'll still be good to get the shrine in Goron City. Oh, beans. Oh, his little toesies are on fire. I know, buddy. That can't be comfortable.
This is such a niche audio trope that I like, but I love it whenever they're doing a big camera pullback and when the camera like swishes close by something, it does a little whoosh sound, even though logically it shouldn't. <laughs> Hey, buddy. Mm. What? How did you know? Mm. Wait. Oh! Where the fuck is the shrine? I can hear it taunting me. Went the wrong way. God, what a goober. Alright, give me the shrine. Give me the shrine. You look like you have a side quest, and I look like I don't have time for that right now. Alright, let's just. <laughs> Am I bold enough? Not yet. Hello, future quest objective. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, no lizard. <laughs> no lizards? Okay, anyway. Oh, please. Oh, please. Where's the shrine? There's the shrine. I love the way the gorons move. It's so funny. Okay. Oh, an Octorok is trying to destroy me in the left. The idea of there being a Korok in the Goron region that just immediately catches on fire is unfortunately hilarious to me. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's gonna be another use fire to burn things quest. Hmm. Let's switch back to the not bad arrows. Okay, well, I guess if the lady I wanted to summon doesn't show up until later, we can just sell our stuff as per the norm. Um, see if we get enough to uh, free that great fairy, and then uh, see if said great fairy will uh, upgrade our outfits, and then I'm gonna call it an evening. I promise. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Oh, sick. That would have been really useful when I was killing Taluses earlier. Oh no, I think I remember this one. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Uh, pfft, oh, I don't think we really need this anymore. Bye! Little spider things. Nope. <laughs> Swat. Get out of here. Thank you. Oh. Hello. Oh, she's in the inn? Then we'll go check out the inn after I finish this shrine. God, why can't you guys just be right about things all the time so I don't end up being wrong about stuff? <laughs> I'm not asking for much, just perfection. All right, where are we going? Uh. Ah, oh, convenient. Okay. Cool. Just comes back. Neat. Right. Hey, 
Hey, nice. That would have been convenient with finding a talus earlier. Ooh. Ah, I see. Okay. That's confusing. Okay. What a puzzler that one was. I mean, I say that, but, you know. Nice. Trying to save the world and Zelda and stuff. Ah, I see the problem. Okay. Did that work? Yes, good. There we go. Okay, cool. So it was basically just the next room. Awesome. Yeah, yep. Yep, resourcefulness, thanks. Man, you know, it's been a while since we got ambushed by a combat trial. I suppose they don't tend to make those the um, shrines for cities or towns. Okay, let's go find the gem lady. She's around. <clears throat> We're gonna see how much we can make by selling all these bad boys. Okay. Back to Goron City! Woo! Oh, pardon me, sir. All right, where's the inn? Oh, don't that is. Lizard? Yes! Heck yeah, free lizards. Just lying around outside. What they don't want you to know about free lizards. All right. Uh, okay, so this way and then the left? Maybe. Yeah. This way? Okay, yeah, cool. We got it. Brutal lady. Brutal lady. Hello, are you in here? Excuse me, sorry. Hi, trying to bug a brutal lady. Aha! Hello! What? It's. <laughs> Who are you? Ah, good. <laughs> Aren't you hot? Oh, on your skin? Is that... So I've been drinking them. Is that how you're not supposed to use them? Can you... Uh. Oh no. She won't buy my jewels until I get rid of Varudania! Damn it! Okay, fine, whatever. I guess we'll sell them for normal price, and then the next time we have a Blood Moon, we'll do this whole rigmarole again, and then we'll sell her the jewels at better than regular price. But at least we can get back to Goron City whenever we want now. <laughs> God, okay, where are we going? Um...
Yeah, we can sell them here. There's no, no reason not to, I guess. Oh, hello? Customer? Hey, do you have a shop or what? Mm. What? Oh, 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 okay, okay. Oh, he's, we, we motoring. Oh, thank goodness that went too far. Mm. Is it the armor shop? I wonder where Varadania was for the last hundred years. Hello. Yeah. Ripped and shredded my armor shop. I want to sell. Take all of my jewels, please. Okay. Whew. Ooh. It's not bad. That's still not enough for the Great Fairy. Pretty nice. Still can't get the Great Fairy. Whew. But we did do the thing I said we were gonna do. Killed all them taluses. Okay. So, the last thing we're gonna do today. I solemnly swear. <laughs> we're gonna finish Terrytown. I can sell monster parts later, but I could also sell him to Kilton, uh, but he doesn't pay real money. He pays in some weird, like, crypto monster books. Now, I believe... On the plus side, we can finish our house now if we want to. Um, Alright, now that we're out of mortal peril, the guns are coming back out. Thank God. You know, it's not the worst look in the world with the pants. Not the best look either, but I don't hate it. All right. Now I believe this is the last guy for the Terrytown quest. And I think if we go to Terrytown afterwards, it's gonna play a beautiful cutscene and the Terrytown quest is gonna be over. And because that's the last thing we have to do is literally just go there and have a cutscene play, I think we're gonna do that. And then I'm gonna stop streaming, eat some food, uh, and, uh, do something else for a little while. Hello, you're the depressed guy? Hi. Capson! Wait a moment. You! You're Link! The perpetrator who forced Lady Miba- Bro! Bro, I was not involved in recruitment, okay? I think, you, as you'll find in the Champion's Ballad memories, uh, Zelda is the one who did all the recruitment. I was just sitting there. Oh, okay. Yeah, you seem so forgiving. Were you not paying attention when I defeated Divine Beast Varuda and freed me for soul? And now she hangs out with me, like, all the time. Gosh, you're such a downer, Capson. <laughs> well, get a load of this. <laughs> You're never going to believe it. My collar isn't too far from here. It was pleading me to hurry there right away. By yourself? No need to worry about me. I've always had confidence in my fins and feet. <laughs> okay, there he goes. You should come as well. Yeah, why not? I guess I could attend a wedding. Nail. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go to Terrytown. Oh, it really isn't that far from there. I think the giant cliffs in the way kind of fooled me. Oh, yeah. We might need to... Okay, yeah. 
yeah, we also need to get the Bolson guys. But that's just a quick stopover in Hateno. We, we could also finish off our house while we're there. I mean, you know, it's just like six more things. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, let's... If it gives us the opportunity, we'll, we'll probably do it, because we're going to need to talk to him anyway. Oh, look at it! It's a finished town! We did this! I mean, you know, we, we didn't do all of it by ourselves, but, like, we did this! All that wood? That's my hard work, baby. I brain guardians for that stuff. Grayson! I'm all done breaking rocks! I was told to stand here. Is something supposed to happen? It's a ghost of me to use the goddess statue while you guys are doing the wedding. Aww. Look who's a happy couple! Vasa. What? I came to congratulate you on your friggin' wedding! <laughs> Some work. Well, you know, I guess the grind never sleeps. Hey. Found Azora. Next is, we'll have to invite guests. I see. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I'll go there. Okay. Okay. Just one last ride. Do you think they'll fix my house before we go? <laughs> oh, baby. It's another seven hour. This is why streaming this is good, because if I don't have people watching along and holding me accountable, uh, I would just keep going for seven plus hours and not notice, and nobody would benefit, except for me playing this fun game. So, you know, really, we're all doing each other a favor here. Hey, Bolson, before we attend a wedding together... Can you fix fix my house? Thank you. Please and thank you. Hello. Hi, Bolson. Hello. Uh, Aw. Oh. <laughs> no, we gotta do the invitation. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, we'll finish the house next time, then. Hi. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna very slowly walk all the way up to Terrytown in the Akala region. If you wait 59 minutes, you can end on the hour like you said. I suppose I never specified which hour. Alright, let's go finish Terrytown, baby! Dress nice? It's a wedding? Uh, hmm. Yeah, I guess we gotta figure out what, what makes a good, good wedding attire. Alright, let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Well, the Guardian Circlet is the nicest hat we own. Although, the Vaux hair is pretty good. But no, the Desert Circlet's better. And it's highly battle ready. <laughs> Oh, did we never get the Phantom Greaves? That's a shame. That would have been really funny. Um. Mm, 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 nah. Nah, I'm not really feeling that. We should probably wear our dress clothes, you know? <laughs> what we did back in the day. Or... <laughs> You know, nice and cash. 
<laughs> we got to represent the brand, you know? <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. Yeah. Isn't this like... These are from like... Oh, this is a terrible combination. Oh, I hate it. I hate it so much. You know, personally, I, I think we're at our fanciest when we are impervious to most forms of harm. And this is the most expensive thing we own, so... And we should have the Master Sword out for this, you know? It's only appropriate. Excellent. All right. Let's do the wedding, baby. Uh, hello. Uh-huh. 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 Yay, I said it right. Congratulations! <laughs> Hudson isn't all that great at things besides show depression, but I guess that isn't a huge deal, is it? Madam, he's right there. <laughs> Hudson, Hudson. Okay, there we go. Hey! Thank you. Let's go! Let's do the wedding, baby! Probably could have worn my Gerudo outfit, but come on. I'm the coolest looking motherfucker at this wedding. <laughs> what do you mean? Whoa, hello, Bolson. God. This dumbass found family. Everything here is stupid, and I love it. Cringe fail, boyfriend. <laughs> Yay! Ah, Romance is truly a beautiful thing. Zelda's like, Link, not that I'm complaining about you spreading happiness, but what are you doing? Okay. Great, all right, we talked to Hudson one more time and then I think we're done. Hey, sick wedding, bro. Hey. It's me. Are you crying? No, something in my eye. Tears. Now Terrytown looks like a real town at long last. This is all possible because of you. Can't thank you enough for all the hard work you did. All right, this is for you. Whoa! Wow, thank you! You're so nice. Ronson and I have no use for them. It's not like diamonds are traditionally used in engagement rings. You can have them. Great! We're done. All right. Well, thank you so much, everybody, for tuning in for this, uh, this, this beautiful, wonderful homestead we've just, uh, contributed to the creation of. <clears throat> and by contributed to, I mean provide all the materials, money, talent, skill, clergy, you know, everything else. Um... Yeah, uh, thanks so much for watching and for uh, raising 7.2k dollars for direct relief for uh, Turkey and Syria's uh, earthquake relief, which is fantastic and incredible on all of your parts. Um, 
If you're watching this video as a VOD, uh, and we have not yet reached a 10k goal, you should know that you can reach, uh, if you guys reach the 10k goal, uh, the next time I stream, which might be next week, might be a little bit later, kind of depends on, you know, how much I can get done this week and, uh, yeah, how quickly I want to play more Breath of the Wild, which is usually all the time, but, you know, these things change. Uh, the next thing is going to be trying to do Vana Boris, uh, the scary robot camel lightning thing in the Gerudo Desert. Um, <clears throat> which will also involve doing the Yiga Clan, so that'll probably be the longest uh, of the preamble segments. Anyway, uh, yeah, so that's the that's the goal. Oh, shit. Uh, well, thanks to whoever just dropped another $400. Oh, do we need to talk to Bolson again? Wait, what? Wait, what? Why is everyone yelling? Where is Bolson? Is Bolson in town? Hold on, let's find him. Well, uh... God damn it. Where are you, you stylish bastard? God, how long has there been a dog here? Focus. Ah, there he is. Hello. Mm -hmm. Hi. Indeed. Oh, oh, uh, oh, such a sublime, precious thing, you know? My best wishes to the couple. Now that the wedding's over, we should probably head back to Hideno Village. Oh, I see. Well then. Hi. Carson. We're going home. Oh. Okay. Wow, I can see why you guys made me do that. What scintillating rapport. <laughs> anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Oh, boy. Um, yeah, uh, this is, as always, really fun for me, so I'm, I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. I continue to be impressed that these things are averaging about 2,000 concurrent, concurrent viewers for most of the runtime, which is... Um, fucking bonkers, but I'm glad you guys are liking this, um, because I'm having a good time, and we're doing good things with it, so everybody wins. Um, anyway, uh, I'm gonna go and eat real food and stuff. Uh, also, 7.7k. You guys are really killing it right here at the end, so uh, thank you all so much. Um, I'm looking forward to Vana Boris, and I'm also looking forward to doing stuff before Vana Boris, because, you know, honestly, it, we always kind of highlight the, the goals, but like, this is a good cause, and any amount of money that goes towards it is good. So it's not like, oh, it doesn't matter if we don't hit 10k. Like, it all matters, you know? Hitting 10k is just a bonus, because that way you guys can determine what I do in this beautiful, nonsensical, open-world game. Um, anyway, I'm gonna let you and me go. So, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!